Yo. Wup, 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 wup. Hello. Welcome back to the Citadel of Nonoms. Today we have a special mission. We're going to join a SMP Minecraft server. So there's going to be other people there. Um, which is exciting because, you know, I've, uh, you know, how I've been playing on a single player world for the longest time. Just, you know, exploring our own Minecraft world. And it's, it's unique for me because I've never done a multiplayer, you know, modded multiplayer Minecraft ever. So this is all new to me. And, um, uh, we'll see how it goes today. We're gonna go in. I don't know if there's like special rules or not. You know, there might be, it might be like some kind of RP element to it from what I'm getting the vibes of, but we'll see. Do -do -do. I think I'm gonna just jump right into it for now. I think that they might even be waiting. People might be waiting in the spawning area. So, got my Minecraft it. Ikazul. Ikazul. Um, where is it? Can you see it? All right. So this is, um, uh, Dragon Riders SMP. It's hosted by a content creator, a streamer. His, I think he goes by, um, Emo Ace. Actually, I should probably link his, um, description in the bio or in the description. His bio? Link his info on the bio. I should have. Scoopity boop. Boop boop boop. Yo, 2MWG. 2MWGS, what's up? I don't think I've seen you around before. Hello, hello. Welcome. And if you're new here, you are a nunum from now on. You're a... Uh, uh, that's what these uh, little bouncy guys are called. This little white bouncy guy up here is uh, no, no, it's the mascot of our channel. We have some deep lore that you'll find out about him later. But all you have to know is you're very powerful, okay? You can wield time in your own hands physically. You're king? Oh, welcome back, king. <laughs> welcome back. Are you ready to play some Minecraft? This is a private server. Um, it's wait. Am I allowed to show this stuff? So there's eight people on the server right now. J Dario. Wait, let's see. Galley, Galley, Emo Ace. So Emo Ace is the one who's hosting the server. Chupuko. Anonymous players. Rowdy Kun. Okay, that's interesting. Anonymous players, huh? So Chupuko, we know. Um, she's been in our chat a few times, and I've you know lurked in her chat a few times. I'm a I'm a rat disciple of hers. Okay. I'm a student. I'm gonna link the live on TV. Yeah. <laughs> what do you mean? Uh, as long as I don't show the uh, IP, I think it should be fine. And also, it's a whitelisted server, anyways. So even if you know the info, um, you won't be able to snipe us. I think you have to apply um, to uh, Emo Ace if you want to join. I got lucky. Chupuko kind of invited me. Um, and we might even run into her today. And the funny thing is, we've never actually formally met, you know? We've, we've we've been in each other's chats, but we've never actually interacted. Is that? But that, that goes with everyone. Oh okay, my goodness, I'm gonna help Ben, here. too, because I need to Hi, download Duffy. his stuff for Ben. Hello? If you, Dora, Wait, can if you, you hear me? Hello? Well, let me know, okay? Yeah, we can yeah. hear you well. Oh, okay. Hello, Rowdy. Okay. We can hear you, and we can you. He's a dwarf. Oh, put him down, cutie, put him oh, down. Oh, you guys are so okay. cute. I love you guys' skins, all of yours. Everyone's. I like seeing different. It. How do I? Is there is there a way to um do some kind of uh, push to talk? Yes. Yeah, you can switch it once you get in fully. You can, or you can press right, V. All right. V. That's what I've been trying yeah. to do. Yeah. Yeah. yeah press V. I don't, for I don't remember what the original controls. keybind was. Yeah, it's V for. Out. So press V and then go to settings and then activation type voice. Activation type. Ah, okay. And then, and then you can do push to talk. <laughs> there you go. Push to talk, bound, or bind. It to then I believe there's a key bind that you can set in the um, controls. You can go to key binds. Um, e all right, all right. I got it. Thank you, sir. All right. Yeah, no are problem. You, are you Thank um, you. Ace? 
Yes, I am you, boys. Hello, hello, hello. Nice to meet you. I saw you guys actually yesterday in oh. uh, uh, Chipuko's <laughs> TND <D> stream. Oh. <laughs> Yay! Hey, hey, hey. Yummy! So what's what's going on? Are we doing like a like a ceremony of the the beginning of our journey? Oh, <laughs> we are. We are. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll we'll, we'll do a thing again. <laughs> okay, for uh for the two the two new um two new members that joined. So you are doing a ceremony. Yes, I believe in oh. you guys. <laughs> Show me what you got. Uh, yes. my name is Dofi. You can call me Dofi. Um, I am. Uh, do we? Were we supposed to come here with like a lore? <laughs> you can if you want. Or you can just, if you want. <laughs> you can just make it up as you go along. That's Don't worry, everyone's just watching you. Don't worry, uh, no pressure. Yeah. yeah. Well, oh. I've, I've come to observe the humans, okay? Uh, interact with the dragons and whatnot, you know? Um, and I hope uh, to meet you guys along the way and get to know you guys, I guess. And I'm excited. <laughs> Yay! 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 <laughs> All right now, Rowdy. Oh, All right, no, your turn no, now, Rowdy. No. You muted. Rowdy. Speak, Rowdy. Rowdy speak. 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 I muted her with my accent. Speak. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, everyone went silent. This is weird and wrong. Okay, hi. Wait. Okay, go. I'm Rowdy. I'm just a dude. I see it. <laughs> Why are you copying JT? Because <laughs> they're brothers. I was just about to say. Ah, <laughs> oh, I want to play for it. Academic I dishonesty. I... I just got here. Using that, using that AI judge PT introduction. <laughs> Shake my head. All right, now Rowdy and Dolphin, make sure you get your dragon eggs. Yes. Yeah. In the chest. Make your dragon eggs. Oh, egg. all right. <laughs> it's a rite of passage. You first. <laughs> yeah, I forgot how to. <laughs> Um, you might need to restock these. TLDR of the oh. backstory. Dragons fight. Big war. Ah! Burn down. We steal eggs. We beat dragons. Yay. It's like Game of Thrones. It's like me. Yeah. So, do we like hatch these eggs? Do they just hatch if we walk around? Hey, um, that is a good so question. What you need to do is they differ based off of the um, based off of the type of dragon. Um... So I believe the um I believe it says that on it should say that on the um dragon egg. Um Wait, I'm trying to figure out how to open my inventory. Good question. Uh, uh, <laughs> we'll back to you. <laughs> we'll circle back to that. <laughs> Wait, which one do you have, Duffy? Uh, I picked which up the gray one. I'm you know, it's been a while since I played this game and I'm trying to remember how to open my inventory actually. Oh, E. <laughs> oh, E. Oh, okay. There's going to be a lot of e. keybinds you'll need to reconfigure with all the mods. Mm -hmm. Just yeah. Up. yeah. <laughs> all right. Thank you, sirs. Yeah. And ladies. So basically what you do with the dragon egg is that you, depending on which dragon you have, there's ice dragons, fire dragons, and lightning dragons. So each one has a different hash condition. The fire dragon, I believe you... Um, you have the egg in fire so what you can do is you can right click and the egg pops up like this and then you can uh, okay oh okay i guess he has my dragon egg now wow jd <laughs> so what you do is um i believe the fire one you put in fire and you leave it there to kind of cultivate and then eventually it hatches um oh. The ice one, I believe you put it on top of ice um, or in a cold biome. Uh, and and the, the lightning one, I think you need to have it um, hatched during a lightning storm. Oh, okay, so, so we decided or is it already like dragon. decided like the eggs, um, how they're going to hatch? Like we have to experiment with it? Um, yeah, you pr pretty much like um, I think there's like a wiki. Um, Oh, it's oh, the, from the ice and fire mod. Um, there's a um, wiki. I will put that in the Discord chat right now. Um, so you can look up like all the different stuff. If you go to creatures and then, or go to lightning dragon, you can figure out like 
how to um, how to spawn them and everything. So all right, sounds a, good. Yeah, you, you can also experiment. Yes, if you don't want to use the wiki. <laughs> It'll pop yes. up if it's not the right condition. Like, when you try to put on fire, if it does not hatch by fire, it'll pop out of the slot. Okay, I think uh, oh. I'm more of a trial and error kind of guy. This I makes think, sense um, now. I'm gonna bond with my egg yeah. a little bit. <laughs> sorry, <and> Rowdy. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> but yeah, so like you try to put an ice dragon, an ice dragon egg inside a campfire, it'll just pop up and it won't, and so on. So, if you'd like to experiment, you can experiment as well. Oh yeah, you can also um, do this if you press Alt, what? and you can do it in different Ooh. directions. <laughs> I've never seen what it looks like on other people. Doesn't mean I left my desk. Huh? Oh. <laughs> All right. <laughs> so, I saw that you one were... more, you one more so thing. Quick. Since y'all picked your your uh, races, y'all can also pick your class by pressing K you can go one of five paths. You can do either Artificer, Battle Mage, Sorcerer, Alchemist, or Occultist. So each of these classes has its own specialty in magic. Holy shit. And it has its own, um, it has its own like skill tree that you can level up. So basically ah, how you level up hybrid. those, um, mm. how you level up your skill tree is you use that specific type of magic. So for um, for for instance, Artificer would be Evocation Magic and Lightning Magic. So you use those spells and you kill things like mobs and such, and then you gain experience points for that and then you level up your skill tree. So, yeah. But, um, yes, sir! To start off with, you do need to kill a few mobs and get the first little junction, the little heart uh, one, and then oh, you can it's pick like your a proper path. MMO so it might take a tiny bit to, to, grind, to get like, to the and classes, up. but eventually so you'll get there. Leveling up actually has meaning. So leveling up actually killing. has meaning in this world. <laughs> yes. Mm -hmm. Like an actual MMO. <laughs> yeah. Does killing players count as anything? Well, um, I don't think so. We can find out. Find out. Uh, <laughs> why do you look at me? <laughs> oh. Uh oh, anarchy. Hold on, hold on. Let me get the let me get the battle music. Let me get he's the battle music. He's evil. He's evil. JD's hitting a There's woman. There's a lot of different um key things <laughs> as well. Wow. Oh yeah, and Wait, also with with your um, Ow. if you go into your inventory and you see that little shirt icon you can press that and put on cosmetics now the cosmetics are you have to create them yourself pretty much um or so, get your parents credit cards you get them right away no we don't have one of those bots <laughs> yeah. but, not yet but yes. you if you're familiar with block bench you can basically make your own outfit or your like extend your skin to be um like add Emails? horns or something along those <laughs> lines or whatever you want to do. Wings. What? So, wait, how do you do that? It's the shirt. Yeah, the shirt icon. Oh wow! I want. So what? Do you click on? How do you add stuff to it? You need to create it <laughs> yourself. But like, how do you oh my create gosh. it? Usually using like Block Bench. The B is email. Which is a bench. program. Oh, um, I gotta download a program. Yeah, sorry. Is it free? <laughs> yeah, it's free. <laughs> okay. As long as it's free. There you go. All right. Any more rules, Ace? Um, rules are in the Discord, and you know, just in general, uh, the general server etiquette. And but, you know, overall, just have fun with it. You know, there's everything's kind of like, um, very hands off. You can do whatever the heck you want, really. And you know, come and go as you please. All and right, but I'm out of here. Uh... Not like that. <laughs> oh, wait, oh, he's oh. Wait, how do you do that? <laughs> I don't mean that. But like, no you get what fly. I. So, some of y'all can can fly. Y'all do have. Yeah, where did you get all um, this bread? The phase do have it. wings. Um, oh, you work, you work the farm. The farm's the only out. thing that's standing. Oh, all right. So, anyway, parties. Without further ado, let's. 
Get this party going! Let's go! <laughs> Let us commence. The... <laughs> 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 Alright, I'm gonna set oh, so I'm gonna cool. set the time <laughs> time set day. And then right. scatter oh. JD oh, oh, oh. Oh. Feel free to come back to oh, the village because I will be building more on it to build, the, um, build the, rebuild okay. the village. So yeah. This is grab something. Oh yeah. Stop on by whenever and you also want. you can you can develop factions oh. if you want. Oh, so that's that's out there. There's sacrifice, no set factions right now, but sacrifice. we just did. <laughs> uh oh. All right, I'll see you guys out in the wild, okay? All right. Okay, <laughs> Darby. See you. Right. See you later. See you. Go that way. All right. So basically, we're, we're playing north. like north. a straight north north craft, be, essentially, uh, soon, so and we'll find out um, kind of factions start forming, and um, yeah, I guess. <laughs> I guess that's what, that's what we're doing. We need to hatch our egg first, though. Well, and also figure out our keybinds and stuff. And I don't want to get in people's ways, just like you know, being lost with my keys. Okay, so let's see. We have mods. Wait, mods, nicknames. There's a lot of mods. There's like a hundred and sixty something mods in the server. So. It's a lot different than what we're used to playing vanilla Minecraft. Um, I also want to decrease my mouse sensitivity if that's possible. Ooh. Increase our POV as well. Um, video settings. Controls. Mouse settings. Okay. Decrease it a lot. See how that's like. Is that good? Bit low to my liking, but I can get used to it. And also, we have a mini map. You little num, you're too big. You need to scale down a little bit. Scale down a little bit, my friend. So we can see the mini map. Cool. Uh, but I'm definitely gonna get lost constantly. Let's see if those guys are still there. <laughs> Sneak. Also, I need to know how to crouch. It's like crouching was one of the biggest parts in Minecraft. You know, when you're like mining at a cliff, you need to crouch so that you don't fall off, right? Okay, so keybinds, uh, controls, keybinds. Left control is sprint. Wait, what? Sneak is left shift. Oh, I don't think we can crouch. Hack is left button. Dragon breath is R. Dragon down, X, G, Dragon Strike, Pick, Block, Middle Button. I'm gonna go solo leveling for a bit. <laughs> Use Item, Right Button, that's all. Okay. So R, X, G is all something. Wait, G? What? The crawl is not brown. Okay, wait, hold on. Oh, okay. So shift is crouch. Interesting. And control is sprint. I want to switch these around. That is um not standard, right? Change that to left shift. Sneak would be control. All right. I think that's basically all we need to know for now. Um, so R and X does something. I think they they might be skills that we need to level up maybe. Wait, no. X opens up some crafting inventory, crafting menu. Ooh. What? <laughs> so holding G, you can hold a, you can create a group. <laughs> you can create a group with holding G. Okay. I guess for now, we can like create some kind of monument and just explore or explore, you know, the lands. Stony Shore. And I think I see people on the minimap. 
So if you're uh, not on the same faction, perhaps when you're warring with another faction, you'll be able to see if people are coming up on you because it shows on the mini map. Wow. Not a good start. <laughs> I want to get out of here. <laughs> I should probably craft the essential tools that we need to survive as well. I completely forgot that this is Minecraft. Oh, someone made an achievement mining. <laughs> I want to do that too. Okay, we need to get some rocks. <laughs> the bay, the bear necessities, you know, the bear essentials. We need to get logs too, actually. What is going on? <laughs> okay, so I am the red thingy on the mini map. All right, let's head this way. I wonder how big this um, server is, or if it's um, basically a randomly generated world. It's the same for all different uh, SMPs that use this mod, perhaps. Okay, we need we need to get some trees. We need to make a wooden pickaxe, I think. <laughs> I can get out of this cliff area. I saw some guy flying earlier as well. So I wonder if we can fly. I want to fly. <laughs> Controls. Up, up. I don't think flying is possible right now for me. Maybe, maybe not. Pick block. Oh, and also, I heard that there's a like, uh, there's like a new weapon that you can craft, like a mace. I don't know if we can do it in this server though, because the version is 1.20.1. .1. It's not the latest server. I haven't been keeping up with the Minecraft news lately, you know. Swap item with offhand. Hotbar activator X and C. There's a creative mode. Okay, so the okay, okay. Add the miscellation. Yes. Uh... Ooh, you can faint attacks. Interesting. Oh, there's a lot of stuff. I might, I might try to figure out the controls off stream. Today we'll just be playing regular Minecraft. <laughs> Hmm. Gonna go solo leveling, become big and strong, and return to the group <laughs> as mighty warriors. Oh, also, they said we had we can like choose a like a like a path, right? I was thinking of going alchemist. I don't know what any of these really do, but alchemist sounds fun. The whole concept of sacrificing something for miracles, right? <laughs> FMA. Oh, it's so bright and dark. <laughs> Do we craft stuff just like in regular Minecraft? Let's find out. Yes. We can craft. What is this? Wait. Okay, so we make one of these. Let me make a crafting table. Um, and let's break these down. 
Ah, uh, okay. I'm gonna make myself a wooden pickaxe for now. So we can mine rocks. Oh, 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 oh. Uh, oop. Place this down. Can I do it? Hello? Wait. I can't place it down. <laughs> What's going on? Crafting tape. How do I use it? I thought I just right click. Oh, okay. That was weird. Um, pickaxe? Nani? <laughs> this is not a pickaxe? Wait. Oh, we need sticks. That's right. Sticks. That. And boom. Pickaxe. Alright. And then we can immediately make some stones. I like this atmosphere. But it's too bloomy. Wait, hold on. Um, I think O. Let's change to this shader. Complementary unbound. It might take a while. I think I, I might crash. <laughs> oh, it didn't make too much of a difference. Oh. <laughs> well. Okay, let's make a stone big axe. Boom. <laughs> Uh, I want to make a stone sword, maybe. Um, <laughs> one second. There's a stone sword. Um, what else? What else do we need? Is that a mace? <laughs> How do you make a mace? For now, let's take this stuff out of here. E. I don't like how E is the the inventory. I think I'm gonna switch that as well. Hey. Hey. Okay. What is this? Should probably make a stone axe as well, actually. Ooh, iron. I might be lagging a little bit. I feel a little bit of lag. Advancements going on. Ice and fire. Oh, I think someone might have hatched their dragon. We need to hatch our dragon, right? <laughs> All right, let's uh, let's find a piece of ice, maybe. Our dragon might be an ice dragon. So, I think uh, Ace told us that. There are ice dragons, fire dragons, and lightning dragons. Hopefully our dragon's not a lightning dragon because then the there's a condition that we have to wait for. But there might be ice around here too. Because it's snowy, right? Ooh. Ooh. Oh, okay, so the render distance is what's causing that fog. Alright. So because it's online, right? We can't have like the maximum 64, ooh, or 30, 30 or so. What odd? Um, what are they called? The spawn biomes. We can't see all the way through. It's a little bit limited, but we can. It, wait, what is that? 
And middle mouse button does not zoom in as well, okay? <laughs> it's a button that I used to abuse like crazy, which kind of damaged my mouse's middle mouse button. Hey, are you winning? Not yet. Soon though, once we hatch our dragon, we're gonna win. So we're playing on a Dragon Rider SMP. Um, uh, today is the launch of the server. Um, we had a little bit of a introduction ceremony and um, a beginner tutorial. We were explained what to do with our dragon eggs. Uh, we have this gray dragon egg. There's a couple different colors, but I picked gray because, you know, gray is part of our color scheme and we like gray. We're not quite white. We're not quite black. You know, we fall into the, the middle spectrum. And that's how life is, you know, not everything is black and white. Sometimes you just gotta be a little bit gray. And also I have a dragon skull. <laughs> A lightning stage four dragon skull. And some raw irons. Let's uh get some more rocks while we're at it. EXP, okay. So the way we hatch our dragons is um we have to know what type of dragon we have first. I have no idea. And I was told that we can check on Discord. But we'll find out ourselves. We're going to experiment. We're going to toss our dragon into fire. Uh, we're going to try tossing our dragon into like a, like a piece of ice. And see if it hatches, you know? That way we have this bond. Uh, this journey of figuring out who our dragon is, right? Did somebody die? <laughs> why is why is there 07? Here's some footsteps ASMR while we run around. Oh. Okay, that's a bit of lag right there, but what the multiplayer is, right? There's always a little bit of lag that you need to overcome. We're putting our egg on the snow. <laughs> Oi. Okay, so not snow. I think it does have to be ice. And then if not, we can try finding like a like a magma pit. And hopefully our egg doesn't get destroyed in the magma. <laughs> Fire. Ooh. Aha. Uh -huh. Now today I had Subway for breakfast and guess what? <laughs> I get excited by the smallest things. Honey oat bread is back. Yo. I missed that thing and now I have a reason to eat at Subway again. The oven roasted chicken breast might be gone. But the honey oat bread is back. Oh, hello. Let's kill this thing. Ooh. Oh, wow. There's different uh, attacking animations. We can thrust, we can swing. I think it's part of the better combat mod that we have going on. Press the waddle away. Waddle away from what? 
You're not trapped inside the tome thingy anymore. Still good. Sekuro instead of Dofi? Oh, it's all good. I knew what you were talking about. You can always say streamer if you don't remember our names. <laughs> Been a while? Yeah, it's been a while and a half. How have you been? How have you been doing? Have you been affected by the whole, you know, the VTuber dramas that's been going on in 2024? You know, I, I was gone during, you know, a lot of the initial terrible launch of 2024, right? But I was keeping up with what's going on. Oh, what is that? That was pretty sad. So much, uh, so much bad news left and right, you know? But for why? How do you do streamer number 753? I'm good. <laughs> streamer. Alright, we're leaving the, the snowy area, I think. Um, which is a shame because we didn't find any ice yet. We'll just keep going. You dodge the drama because I only follow indies. Oh, okay, okay. That's I guess that's a good thing. But indies also, you know, sometimes there's drama between indie VTubers as well. Especially if um you keep up with the tw the the Twitter stuff, right? Like I stay away from Twitter a lot because it gets pretty toxic. <laughs> Not just for VTubers, you know, Twix Twitter just in general. <laughs> I feel like it's such a toxic environment, you know. Oh, there's a lot of cliffy areas. Water. I might make myself a stove. Oh, we're starving to death. And advance into the Iron Age. Wait, this bread is not helping us at all. Hello? There might be a little bit of server lag going on. Missed the streams? I missed you, little goofy nunum. I'm glad you're back. <laughs> Stay from VTuber with this 18 plus boyfriend ASMR because there's a 50% 50, 50 chance of being a red flag? Oh. <laughs> What do you mean, red flag? What do you mean? What do you mean by red flag, sir? You think there's some toxic, uh... What is that word? What is that buzzword that flies around? Para parasocialism going on with... Ooh, what is this? Am I being followed by somebody? There's a person over there. In the mini-map. J. Dario. He's kind of far away though. Alright, so what is this? We're in some kind of castle. It's a village! It's a village! Or like plus 5 evocation oh? magic power that you can get. And so if you basically, if you want to min-max Here. So you drop the cheese, one of them's gonna grab it. You just gotta wait. <laughs> there we go, see, see, one of them grab it and he's gonna run, and then he's gonna come back and he's gonna he's gonna come back with more cheese. It's it takes a couple tries, but uh You'll know because you'll get like Say, an achievement or something. Or herb, so. I don't major that. Oh, we're back. Probably We're back in the spawn. Okay. Um, Got it. All right. If your rat could have a hat, what kind of rat? Can you what switch kind of at any time if you want? don't like? Right, or so we is, came are you back like, with some food. It, you're like, yeah. <laughs> Normally, once you pick it, you're um, in it. But I can switch y'all. Okay. Yeah. I mean. 
like a party hat. I think hat, we chef need a bed crown. as well, right? Yeah, going on with that, so <laughs> I think I think I'm uh, I'm probably gonna go with that anyway and stick yeah, with it. I'm going with the battle mage too. <laughs> Yeah, I'll I'll be like lightning mostly and Going and up. and like a, a night. Yo, Abby, what's type, up? Electric night. Hello, hello, sorts. hello. Oh, okay. How are you doing today? Nice. Is there an so. Yeah, and hey, I also, I'll, I'll do that. Yeah. I also plan to add. We're currently more, playing uh, a like SMP Minecraft three? server. We got invited to play on. So, uh, it's called Dragon Riders. So like you can level up specific spells or something like that. Um, so we, it's a very heavily modded so, server, you know. Like, it, there's um, yeah. there's about 160 I, something I odd mods <laughs> installed. So it's not no, like it's a fine. typical it's vanilla the, Minecraft the experience. Thing that I, I really Yo, now let's move away from iron spells and the conversation and over like... there. Um, so basically, this is a uh, the spawning zone. There's about. 30 people in the Discord at the moment? I don't know if everyone's gonna be playing. Right now, there's about 8 or 10 people on the server. And um, we're just all doing our own thing. Um, we have a dragon egg. So everybody is given a dragon egg at the start. Um, there's a chest where you grab one. And um, we can hatch it somehow. We have to figure out if um, our dragon is an ice dragon or a fire dragon or like a... Oh. What is the other one? The lightning dragon. And the conditions of uh, letting the eggs hatch is if uh, our egg is a fire dragon, we have to put it in uh, magma, I believe? Or put it near magma or on magma? I'm not too sure. I forgot. It was all explained. Um, if it's not a fire dragon, in the, the egg's just gonna like pop back up and uh, we'll pick it up, you know? If it's an ice dragon, we have to place it on a piece of ice and hope that it hatches. If not, then it's probably a lightning dragon. And um, that, we probably have to make like a copper rod and wait for a thunderstorm to happen to, to let our, our dragon egg hatch. But you know, the thunder dragon egg is the most difficult to hatch, I think, because if we have to wait for the temp like the, the, the weather, right? Then it's something that we can't really control, right? So it must be the best dragon, you know, if it's a lightning dragon. <laughs> We'll see. We'll see. Whichever dragon it is, though, I am happy with it. I am trying to bond with my egg right now. Love modding this game? Yeah, I guess Minecraft is, like, popular because of the, the fact that it's so modern, right? Like, a lot of a lot of old games, um, they're, you know, they survive due to the modding community. Like, DayZ, right? DayZ wouldn't be DayZ without the modding community. GTA wouldn't be GTA, you know, it wouldn't be as much of a big hit if it wasn't for the modding community, you know? It's so much so, in fact, that Rockstar Games actually bought the the mod, the, the modding uh, launcher, right? The 5M launcher, a few months ago. That was a pretty big deal. You're pretty excited? You're excited to see it! Ho oh, ho ho, I'm excited too! <laughs> you know, I do that voice a lot, right? The, the ho! Oh. What's going on today? <laughs> I've been doing that a lot because, um, wah! Oh. This. Oh, what? Nani? A green toolbox. Can I take these stuff? Can I just grab them? <laughs> what? What happened? What? Nani? <laughs> Oh, wait, there's a fire. Let's see if our egg will hatch. <laughs> Maybe we just leave it for a little bit. Let our, let our egg chill, okay? We're gonna let our egg chill in the fireplace for a little bit, and maybe it's gonna hatch into a fire dragon. <laughs> this is probably not how to do it. And I feel like um, this fireplace is gonna set this whole place on fire. Maybe it's not safe. Everyone bonk Dofi? Why? Why? Are you mad because I was gone for so long? Oi! Ah! <laughs> oh wait, we can cook our meat here too. I forgot. Let's see. Pretty sure we can 
Place our meat in the fireplace. Yeah! Nice. Is that a bed? What is that? A green seat? What do I do with this? Shift. Hold shift for summary. Uh, sit yourself down and enjoy the ride. We'll anchor a player onto a moving contraption. Great for static furniture too. Comes in a variety of colors. Ooh. Interesting. We can sit on it? Wait. <laughs> Press left control to dismount. Cool. I'm gonna carry this around. It's because it's so new, I've never seen it before. Is PvP allowed? It's allowed? Uh, but, you know, there's consequences, right? Uh, actions have consequences, so... It might be allowed, but then, like, if you start PvPing people, you know, word's gonna spread, and it might not, you know, <laughs> be the best way to make friends, because there's people here. And it's a... It's a private server. It's a private, um... What is it? SMP, right? It's a whitelisted server. I think you have to apply to um, Emo Ace. I, I'm gonna I'm gonna change my description in a bit to link to his um, YouTube channel. If you look up Emo Ace, uh, it should appear. But I think he streams primarily on Twitch, if I'm not mistaken. I got invited by Chupuko. It's I think it's Chupuko's main like group of friends. Like she's been doing quite a few streams like DND, uh, Dungeons and Dragons, and I've seen the people today uh, earlier in the kind of like the the reception area. Um, some familiar faces, some familiar names, familiar voices that I all heard from Chupuko's Dungeons and Dragons stream. <laughs> All right. We are exploring uncharted territories right now. What is this? Hello? <laughs> are these walruses? Walruses, they're, they're a mod, right? It's not like new to vanilla Minecraft. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, there goes our pickaxe, but I think I made another one. Huh. I guess I didn't. Oi, oi, oi. Um, pickaxe. Stone pickaxe. Let's go. Creatures? What? Creatures mod? Are you saying this is a creature spot? The walrus? You know, I, I was really hoping that uh, the crab would have gotten selected for the, the mob vote a few months back. But unfortunately, I think the aardvark won. And a lot of people were angry about that because like... Um, a lot of the big streamers, right, the big Minecraft streamers, they did mock votes to see potential winning outcomes. And the art fork was always losing, you know? It was always either the crab or the wolf. Or was it a dog? But then it turns out the art fork wins. Nani. <laughs> I think they're from Alex's mobs. Alex? I don't know any... I don't really know like the modding scene, so... Forgive me if I'm, you know, very illiterate when it comes to the mod stuff. I'm a very like vanilla person. When I play games, you know, like... If I... There are some really modded DayZ servers that I... I could have played, but like, um, the most modded server I've ever played was actually the Stalker Z one. But then, like, it was actually well done. Like, everything made sense. There's no weird UI just like flying everywhere in your face, you know? 
Like, those are the kind of stuff that brings you out of the immersion, right? When there's, like, just texts floating around in your face. I'm not talking about chat either, you know? It's not, like, people chatting, but, like, let's say... Let's say there are some Minecraft servers where as soon as you hop in, there's, like, a wall of text just, like, telling you what to do and um, what everything is. That stuff, I mean, like, it works for some people. Some people like it. And I can see how, you know... Uh, it's very convenient to have, but it is immersion breaking and for me when I play games immersion is quite important, you know I think that's why I enjoy like um Slow burn content like GTA RP streams, you know day Z streams Sometimes mods are too much. Yeah You know mods are good but too much of a good thing it's a bad thing. You know that saying? Too much of a good thing can be a bad thing. Right. I'm not really utilizing the... I'm not utilizing the minimap very much, but I am seeing some kind of creeper icon. I don't know if you can see that in my resolution. By the way, when you watch my stream, do you guys watch it in like... 1080p, 720p, or 1440. Because you know, 1440p is available if you want. We have it. <laughs> there's a world barrier, so there's no world gen lag but it seems there is world gen lag regardless oh emo ace that's the the person who's hosting the server he he's actually renting like a eight gigabyte server and he's paying about like fifty dollars per quarter so we should we should all thank emo ace you know we'll send out we'll send you guys over to his stream afterwards if he's still streaming by the time we're finished and we can say thank you for hosting you know be cool. It's very inspiring that he's like stepping up to do this because I was I was really planning on like doing it myself. You know, I talked about it before. Um, opening up that uh, my my world with a UFO, right, so that people can build their own thing. This year, though, there's like um, it's you know, there's like we have a we have a mission, right? We want to first hatch our egg, and then um, it's very medieval fantasy themed right so it's not like vanilla vanilla minecraft so i guess like there's like a different it's like a different genre and maybe one day i'll still open up that uh server and i'll actually have people to invite because like if i get to know the people in this server you know we'll be you know inviting them for all sorts of different things maybe we can even join chupuko's like D, &D <laughs> the dungeons and dragons thing one day i'm scared you know I'm scared because Dungeons and Dragons is a very creative game, you know, it's all about your imagination and um entertainment. Oh what's that? I don't wanna, you know like try to you know be too cringe or anything, you know? There's a good balance between being funny and being cringe in DD. Or maybe I think too much. I get that pretty often as well. There's always um, a plan to try out like a... Uh... Oh. Do I have food? Yes. Always have the plan to try out like a GTA RP stream. But like in a completely public server that already exists, you know? Being cringe can be a waste of time. Yeah, it's true. I do like live by that, but like for some reason, I don't know why, I get super self conscious about like when I'm around, like you know, when it comes to other VTubers for some reason. Like, you know, when I was taking my break from YouTube, I was doing, I was practicing like GTA RP, right? But I was being like super cringe and I was, you know, I was doing the whole ho 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 
what's going on to you guys? <laughs> what? <laughs> uh, today I feel very excited and I'm going to eat bananas all day. <laughs> you know? I was I was usually people would cringe when <laughs> they 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 do like a weird voice, you know, talking to people, but um I I wasn't feeling any cringe at all. In fact, I was starting to wonder if that's act that's my true self, you know, I was getting confused. Because I, I, I was being that character for so long that I started using that character's antiques, like um, verbal tics and stuff in my everyday um, <laughs> everyday talk, my everyday speech. The worst that ever happened was like, so my character, right, he does the little <laughs> at the end of every sentence. <laughs> I was ordering uh, uh, Pad Thai. I was like a couple weeks ago and I was like, thank you. <laughs> the lady just stared at me. So I was ordering in person. It's <laughs> like, thank you very much. <laughs> it just came out. <laughs> but I I took a break from that character as well. So that, yeah, I think I explained it before. Like eventually we're going to explore back. Uh, it's called Legacy RP. If you if you go to 5M and search up Legacy RP, it's gonna appear. It's a private, it's a public server rather. Anyone can join, as long as you read the rules and you conduct yourself, you won't get in trouble. There's people who don't read the rules and play Legacy RP as if it's GTA RP or GTA online. They're gonna get banned in like a few hours. You know. That's why it's like um, it's a pretty good. Like a like a streaming server as well because it's so well maintained, and the the developer he he streams um content as well which is cool. I feel like I'm just running around in circles. <laughs> let's go let's go back this way. Um, clear out all the fog of war. Okay, in the map, the fog, and uh, discover new explorable places. <laughs> Got some beefy PCs, it won't be a problem. Service is modern, not a good idea for shaders. Oh uh, yeah, my my beefy PC can handle it. And also, you know, um, the server is um, eight gigabytes, right? So there's a limit to the render distance. The typically, you know, we will be able to see a lot farther out in single player mode, right? Like you can see the the ocean the seams. I forget what they're called. The biome. Uh, what are they called again? Those blocks, those biome blocks. Oh, look at all these accomplishments going on, and I'm not doing anything. I'm falling behind. I'm falling behind. <laughs> Chunks, you're right. Toku. Oh. <laughs> you're right. <laughs> They're called chunks. I don't know why, like, English vocabulary evades me a lot. Uh, I don't know why. Because, I, you know, I speak, I speak a lot of Korean lately because, um, you know, my, my parents, uh, My parents and you know my family they they are very Korean oriented. We speak to them in Korean a lot. Um, English though, like I don't have a lot of people to talk to these days. So maybe that's why. And I'm also learning Japanese, right? So like my brain is starting to exceed its limits and I think it's forgetting English words in order to you know, remember Japanese words instead, which is not good because English is my primary language and then I'm, I'm getting to the point where, you know, my Nihongo is not Jozu, right? I'm not good at Japanese, but my English is getting worse. <laughs> so like, what? What am I? <laughs> Can I speak Japanese? Can I speak English? Can I like speak at all? Like, I, I noticed, um, you know, when I was playing Daisy the other day, I actually forgot what a pot was. Like a cooking pot. Because I was talking to Sam, right? The the guy that we met in our adventure. I was, I was trying to tell him to drink out of a cooking pot. But I couldn't remember what it was called. And I was like, ah, in my mind, I know it's like nabe in Japanese. In Korean, it's nembi. But why can't I remember this thing in English? <laughs> Do 
Do do do do do. Okay. We explored the northern part of this map a lot. Uh, I think it's time to go south and west. West and south. This is our spawning village again. This is where we spawned, I think. What? Gotcha. The thing. We'll choose our base zone today. We could. Oh, hello. Hey, are you building your base here? <laughs> no, I just found some stuff to mine, and I'm checking out this. <laughs> The mods and all. Oh yeah, I was checking out like controls. There's a lot of stuff to find out, huh? Because no, I came straight from vanilla. So <laughs> you want shit in the chat? <laughs> I was gonna steal yeah, his emerald, but I think he was <laughs> he was eyeing that emerald. <laughs> I was eyeing that emerald. Okay, we'll leave him be. Um, let's see. This way is west um facing west okay so we explored north west and south is our next goal <clears throat> should we should we create our base like really far away or should we should we form a pact with some some of the survivors here and create like an alliance because um you know solo leveling is fun and all but Eventually, we're gonna have to need support from other people, right? And I'm already falling behind with this whole exploring thing. Understand fully, I grew up speaking my native language. Mung? Oh, you're Mung! Cool, Mung. <coughs> Speak it with your parents growing up sometimes because they talk English well, also. I've forgotten how to talk in it. Yeah! Like, language is something that, you know, you have to use constantly. Even if you live your entire life speaking a certain language, if you don't use it, you know, for a few years, uh, you forget it. It's a, the problem I have is that, you know, I do work from home and um, all my interactions, most of my, like, work-related interactions are always, like, through Discord. That's one thing that I'm, I'm really, um regret is that using discord uh for work oh because you know like if you turn your your joys your sources of joy to your work right eventually it becomes work but to me whenever i hear discord notifications it's just i cringe and it reminds me of work and responsibilities and adult stuff why <laughs> But I hate it when like YouTubers, right? When whenever they they use a uh, Discord ping sound for their for their edits, right? I'm always checking my own Discord. Maybe somebody has a question or a, you know something. <laughs> Not great English either. So I'm like a broken person who don't know how to talk. That that's me. There, if we have Sakura, there's probably... I'm pretty sure there's Sakura. It is 1.20.1, the server, so... It is, um... Not the oldest. I think the latest, um, version is 1.20. Oh? Oh, I thought that was a person, like, gliding around. 1.20.4, I think, is the latest version. Is there a way to like look at the map completely? Oh, we we explored the whole thing. We're on an island. Huh. Do we make a boat and leave the island? <laughs> I think that's our plan. It's time to leave our nest. First. Uh I left my crafting table. Right. We can put a crafting table here and build everything we need. Uh, we need a stove, right? Furnace. Um, 
I think we need that. Uh, we can smelt some of these stuff. And let's make a pickaxe again. All right. <laughs> the opposite use Discord to chat with friends while playing. So hearing a notification means in home relaxing. Yeah, yeah, that's that. That's what I used to be. You know, like my friends used to. My friends are all Discord uh, users. We're like super nerds, right? I have, you know, computer science major friends, um, engineering friends, and we're all nerds. We used to play a lot of Dota together, uh, and Discord was basically our hangout spot. You know, people would go out and drink, have fun outside on Saturdays. We'd, we'd be home playing Discord. <laughs> Not playing Discord, but you know what I mean. On Discord, playing games together. And it was, it was like, Discord notifications always meant, oh, my friend is trying to say something to me. But now it, for me, now it's more like, oh, I have work to do. <laughs> it's a nightmare. Everyone wants a private base? Yeah. We can always come back to the island here, you know, to reminisce about the newbie days. Don't know bit dials. But we need we need to build far away. Should we build a should we build a smaller scale UFO on the server? Maybe not. Maybe not. Because this is in fact after all like a kind of like an RP server. It's like a medieval RP, so maybe I'll build a castle. Or like a dragon monument. Do -do -do. Horse, dirt, and dirt. Is there a difference between these two? Forget. We need to build a bed? Hmm. Castle sounds nice. Alright. I'm good at making circular castles. Like circular towers, right? Because um, our UFO is basically concentric circles. Um, which is a harder version of like a regular circular tower. Like a cylinder tower. But I think we can just make a, like a squarish one. Implement some circles. Maybe we, should we try um, looking up a bl blueprint? <laughs> For like a nice big castle. A lot of people who make um, castles on YouTubes. You know, like a lot of the VTubers who do Minecraft. I think they use, they follow a blueprint typically, and that's probably the best way to make a really nice looking castle. But well, we can try messing around with textures and stuff like textures of uh... oh nighttime. We might actually need a bed. A white modern castle. Oh, like a quartz castle. <laughs> Old structure, but made of new materials. Oh? Like with the... Would you consider the the light blocks new materials? Like the... What are they? The sea lanterns? The frog lights? So those things are what makes the, you know, structures look very fancy. And modern. And chic. Or if we want to make it look really old school, we can use lanterns and uh, candles. <laughs> Medieval times, baby. Game of Thrones. You know, this song is, it hits me really deep. <laughs> I love that show, man. I don't know if you guys... Have you guys played MapleStory 2 a few years ago? It was out, like... The game was out for, like, two years, and then it got cancelled because it, it was a failure. 
but I played that game when it came out. It was it was pretty fun for me. But then you do get kind of bored of it. Like the content is lacking. We should get into SMP like this. They seem fun. You know what you should do? You should create uh, a YouTube channel and um, start doing content, right? And then you might get invited. Like, you know, just be a VTuber. <laughs> It seems fun though. It was one of my goals when I started streaming. It's like, you know, I did start watching Hololive when they were in the whole Minecraft era, and that, they're still doing a lot of Minecraft, right? But Hololive was probably the reason why I got into VTubing and Minecraft. Like two birds with one stone, you know? This thing is taking forever. This thing is taking forever. <laughs> And I'm noticing there are no like enemy mobs spawning here too. It might be because it's a spawn island. Hollow Live was the original vampire bringing you into the virtual world. Yeah, I got bitten by the hollow rabbit. <laughs> the rabbit hole. Uh oh. Hey, there's a bit of lag. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> What's crops of the wild? Yay! Monster hunter. I have a piece of moss as well. <laughs> okay, we need to start worrying about our inventory space. We have too much stuff. Too much stuff. I don't even know what this mechanical saw is. Hand crank. Kinetic stress capacity. What's a kinetic stress capacity? Nani? Sounds very physics like. <laughs> Only 12. It's so slow. It's think so slow. Mm. The create mod? Create mod is so cool. You should try it. Nani, what do you mean? <laughs> what does the create mod do? You're running the create mod as well? I'm not sure. I didn't look at all the mods that we have. Um... Cause there's like a hundred something, you know, there's like a hundred something mods. It's a lot. 160 something mods. I, I, all I know is there's, um, uh, there's like a fabric mod. <laughs> it's like, uh, the first, okay. When I, when I found out, you know, all the mods, uh, that you have to install, I thought you had to do it all manually, like one by one. Cause I've never done Minecraft, you know, modded or multiplayer before. Right. So I was about to download them all one by one and I realized like this mod has a dependency, you need that and that and I'm like, there's no way we have to do this all, right? And um, today I found out like there's just a mod pack that you have to, you know, slap on and we're good to go. I was worrying about nothing. <laughs> it's one of the big mods if you, uh, it lets you make machines. It's a little slow but impressive. Oh. You mean these things? I'll check it out. Okay. Got a mechanical saw and a hand crank. So we can we can make like a like a giant machine that can like a like a big mecha robot <laughs> if we do it right. It lets you make almost any kind of farm you can think of. Oh. All right. I know there's like some mods that. Uh, go really crazy with the redstones, right? And you can make, you can like basically make a computer in the world of Minecraft. Like a mini computer. Or if you go super crazy, you can probably create your own operating system, you know? In Minecraft, which is crazy. 
And when I was um, studying, um, the people that, you know, my classmates were people who, like, played Minecraft when they were super young, right? And, uh, basically, they grew up tinkling, 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 tinkering with, you know, the whole physics stuff already. Feel like they had a little heads up thanks to Minecraft, right? Everyone who played Minecraft were super smart. <laughs> so I associate Minecraft with smart people. Oh, I'm dying! I'm starving! Ah! Oh no! Oh, can I eat something? Ah! Ah! Forgot that we have to eat! <laughs> Are we on the map? Okay. Southeast. If we die, I'm sorry. Uh, eat food! Uh. Uh. Please! Be my food! I need to eat you! <laughs> Did I get food? No! Did we get food? Sealed meat! Ah! Right, let's go, let's go back to our, our spot and just die there. <laughs> and we'll run back. And I think if we die, um, the other people can go to sleep and, um, you know, uh, let the night pass. <laughs> it's over? What? What he the? <laughs> I completely forgot that we have to eat. <laughs> Aye. Aye. Maybe, maybe there's some food at, uh, our spawn town. Alright, let's just, uh, starve to death. <laughs> With the new auto-crafter, even normal Minecraft has become amazingly complicated. Oh, that's right! Wait, is the auto-crafter, has it been released? Let's go back. <laughs> that's embarrassing, because it shows... It shows on the chat like, oh, the died of starvation. Everyone knows. <laughs> Everyone saw me die just now. All right, let's go. Oh, no. No! Please! Please, why? Why? Right. This is the way. Ow. Oh, wait, wait, what is that thing on the bottom right? That blue bar? It says 39 out of 100? What is that? What's that? It's on hard difficulty, but it shouldn't be too hard, especially once you get into spells. All right, all right. So it is hard difficulty, okay. We're used to it. We're used to playing on hard difficulty, right? Even though it was like half a year ago, almost. <laughs> I think the monsters themselves don't seem that much of a problem. Um, I don't know if it's the lag that's helping me out, but like, because of the lag, monsters, when we push them away, it takes them a while to like, run back towards us. Oh, it's a big cushion. Who's that? Latest death. Oh, it shows our latest death location. All right. 
Okay. Ow. Oh, you know what? Um, if we kill monsters and level up, I think we can we get skill points that we can add to our skill tree and become like a alchemist or a lightning mage, fire mage, ice mage. There's all sorts of mages you can become in this world. Go back, Ikuzu. Autocraft is out now, although they intentionally made it a little complicated. Is your chi? You think the blue thing is my chi? I don't think I saw it before. It, or was it always there? Maybe I didn't notice. I wasn't paying attention, maybe? It's almost 100, though. Almost at 100. Maybe it's showing us where we died? Is that what it is? If it, if it disappears, our last death disappears? Nope. That's not it. I have no idea. You think it's cold? Maybe? I don't, I don't know. Wait. What's going on? Minecraft. Please. Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. Hmm. <laughs> Wait, what? My corpse! <laughs> there we go. <laughs> you noob. What did you die to? Let's take this stuff. Um. Oh my goodness, that was loud. Let's make a boat and get out of here. Uh, 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 why did I do that? Nope. Okay. This is our goodbye. Wait, die if I jump. Uh, uh. Oh. Um. Eh. Jump scare. Oh wait, that's ice. A dragon hat. If I put it here. <laughs> oh. Wait. No. <laughs> I thought my dragon egg disappeared. Oh! Oh! Am I seeing something? Oh my goodness, what is that? Forgot how to get off the boat. <laughs> I'm stuck. Alright, I don't think this will do it. Ui. Egg! Ikuzo. Fish! Wait, we need food. Maybe we should cook this fish. Because uh, our hunger is kind of low already. Wasn't there a button that just lets you throw away the item that you're carrying in your hand? I thought it was F, but... I think it might be different in this server. Hmm. Excuse me. Excuse my. I still feel a little. <laughs> I still feel that effect of having eaten so much salt yesterday. <laughs> that stupid McDouble that I had. Why was it so salty, man? Or why? But why did you poison me, McDonald's? Whoa. 
That's a whale. What is that? Oh, is the world ending? Or am I just not rendering? Ah! <laughs> Let's get back! <laughs> ah! Ah! Okay, I'm confused. <laughs> it seems like there is a border. I think, I think, um, wait, no, I'm just not rendering it. Yeah, might just be a rendering problem because this side must also, you know, it should render in. Server is rendering these chunks. <laughs> hmm. Can I just take it slow and just go like one, like a uh, block at a time, one shadow at a time? <laughs> what is that white thingy below me though on the mini map? There's something white. A big white thingy down there. I think there's some issues going on. Or saying there's a bunch of server lag. Oh, it's a white whale! It's, it's Moby Dick! Wait, do you think I'm causing this lag? Maybe maybe me trying to get out of this, world, this, um, this island is causing the lag. You think I am? Oh no. <laughs> I can't go back. The the path that I came through is not rendering. <laughs> I came through here, but it, it's gone. Ocean is gone. Okay, it makes finding creepers easy. Um <laughs> Let's see if they start saying something. Ah! I starved to death out in the ocean. <laughs> I can't. I can't see anything. Nothing's rendering anymore. Oh no! <laughs> okay, so we do have skill trees. I don't really know what. We do plus one heart. I want to go do the path of the alchemist. But first, we have to find out what our dragon is, right? So once everyone logs off for the night, it's just time being. All right. So it might be a server issues. Maybe. It just so happened. Maybe it just happened that it happens like while I'm in the ocean. I don't know. <laughs> what if I destroyed the server, you guys? Oh, no. Oh no. Please. Let me at least get to the little island over there. This way. No. Oh. <laughs> Maybe it's the boat? Ocean should be the easier chunk surrender, less amount of blocks. Maybe. Well, I think there's, I mean, the, there's still, um, you know, blocks underneath, like the ocean floor. And maybe some ocean life. The thing is, like, even, even if it's not rendered, I should be able to go, but I can't. I'm just, like, swimming against a block, like a wall or something. This variety. Oh, maybe, maybe. I think maybe I have to relog. You know what? I'll, I'll try. Re I'll try relogging. Um. What? 
What's going on? Oh yeah, yeah. Um, how do I get off this boat? Okay. Let's try disconnecting and reconnecting. Okay, so there's 12 people on the server right now besides me. There's a decent amount of people, I think. Well, the server did just launch today. So there might be a few hiccups that uh, the dev might have to work with, you know, work on. Today. Connecting to the server. Fail to connect. Oh! <laughs> what is going on right now? <laughs> <laughs> that a Borat impression? Oh, we're back. It's not really, it's it's more of a Groot. <laughs> group. Gru, I mean Gru impression. It's a voice that I've been using for my GTA RP um, experiment. Okay. So the chunks are still not loading in. <clears throat> you know, at first I was um I was just messing around and I was trying to imitate XQC's voice at first. And then it just devolved into that. What it, what it is now. The ha ha what's going on today? <laughs> Borat is more like Yes! <laughs> right? Yes. <laughs> I can't. I'm stuck. I think this. I think we're doomed. I think uh, we're doomed. You guys, today uh, it was fun. You know. <laughs> That's my XQZ impression. <laughs> I was I was doing that in the GTA RP as well. <laughs> it's so cringe. Why am I so cringe? Sometimes you just sometimes you just gotta be cringe and accept that. Uh, <laughs> Uh, just accept that you're cringe, and uh, you know you might be happy. <laughs> you might be happy. Just do it. <laughs> just do it. <laughs> okay. How do I get off the boat? You see, is zoom in. Ah, uh, how do I get off the boat? Oh, it's rendering in. Oh my god! Oh my god! Thank you so much! Let's just mine this island out. But first we have to find out how to get off the boat. I'll break my boat. That will work. Maybe. Oh, it doesn't. <laughs> then go free whole lesson, Miss Nile guy. What, what is that? What language are you speaking, my friend? You must teach me. And please don't say any inappropriate things, all right? You goofball. Um, okay, hold on. Options. Controls. Keybinds. Dismount. How do I dismount? Uh, item use. Right button. Uh, swap with offhand. There's a wardrobe too. Equal sign. Building tools are. There's a redo and undo thing. Okay. Left shift to carry on. Nani. Combat roll. Um. There's the casting stuff. <laughs> We're gonna have to bind all that once we get into the sorcery stuff. Cheat item. Nani. <laughs> Danny. 
How do I get off my boat? F G H Y U Um Wait Am I the only person who died? <laughs> in the server? So far I was the first person to die in the server I guess that's an accomplishment There's a player list There's the map Okay, it's control. <laughs> it took so long to figure out. <clears throat> Alright, let's just uh, cook our fish. And hold on to uh, emergency rations, you know? Um, blap, blap. Fish. The charcoal. Okay. Is there anything else we need to build? We have iron, right? Wait, why, why do I only have four iron? Wait, no! <laughs> okay. Ignore that. Ignore it. You heard nothing. I forgot how to make... Um... Armor. Uh, it's fine. I think we should make an iron pickaxe for now. We have a stone sword. Doing the record book? <laughs> How embarrassing is it that I'm the first person to have died in the server? Possibly. Starved to death. There's a lot of lag going on though. Look at that. That there and okay. So I'm guessing the wall isn't actually there. Wait, hold on. So we should be able to keep going down south. Maybe. Cause I doubt that this whole island is everything, right? There's no way. That's too small. <clears throat> you want a real one? Hell yeah. While we're bored, we might as well get all these cobblestones, right? Oh, you know what? Can't we make like stone armor? Isn't that a thing? No, it's not. <laughs> what else can we make with stone? Um, let's see. Ooh, what is this? Fire dragon steel leggings. Fire dragon steel. Wow. Um. Chainmail, drag, wait, dragon, iron dragon armor. I have a dragon skull. Can I wear this dragon skull on my head? Okay, there's a lot of stuff. What about tools? These seem like end game stuff, maybe. That we probably don't have access to at the moment. Look at all this stuff. And I like how they're all unlocked already. You don't have to like, you know, randomly mess with your, your crafting to figure these things out. It's pretty cool. Uh, spruce windows. These are building like home, home blocks, I guess. Structure blocks. Sheep disguised chest plate. <laughs> Dragon wing. Cool. There's a lot. 171 pages of this stuff. Redstone stuff, okay.
That's that's kind of intimidating. What's your goal for this SMP? Um, I don't really have a goal to be honest. You know, um, we're just uh, running around. We're gonna find a place to build a base in, and I guess like eventually once we figure like, you know, just get the feel. We're, we're just getting the feel of this server today, and then. Um, we can, you know, try to make some friends along the way, but, you know, I've never really, I don't know, <laughs> I've never really played the multiplayer Minecraft before. I don't know what I'm supposed to do exactly. I guess we can, like, eventually, you know, group up and try to beat the, the mobs, you know, or if, uh... If different factions do form, we can try to join a frac a faction and just uh, be a part of a, a system, you know? Get a job. <laughs> Maybe be like the, the material person or we can build monuments. There's like, it's like all sorts of stuff we could do, right? There's no set kind of, you know, goal. It's a sandbox, basically. But today, I just want to explore, see what the world has to offer, you know? Let's see if the, the ocean renders back in. If not, we'll just go back to the main island. Okay. You know, it might be that, like, if there's an issue with the server, because since everyone might be in the main island right now, right? Like, the server doesn't have to render all sorts of different blocks. Right? But since I'm by myself heading out like this, maybe the extra amount of, like, stuff that has to render in to the server is getting too excessive, maybe? Oh, and my island is gone. Oh no. Oh no. No. You would make a coliseum and get others to fight in it? You know, that's actually a good idea. <laughs> and because like the server has like uh like a battle system, right? A very good um combat system with magic and extra kind of like bad like fighting animations, right? You can stab, you can swing. That might be pretty cool. Yeah. Go this way. I'm just gonna abandon my boat here and go back to the island. You see, the islands are spawning in just fine. It's just the ocean that's kind of weird. Are these dragons? No, they're not. I see some. Oh, Gally was such a to go and Gally died to Sea Serpent. <laughs> Alright. What should my... I should like set a goal, right? My goal was <laughs> actually to just like go out and find like a like an ice thingy or like a fire thingy to hatch my egg, my dragon egg, but that has uh, come to a devastating end, clearly, because it can't render. Um, what? What do we do? We try going underground and look for diamonds, make some armors. Gally has completed the challenge free willy. Did he kill a whale? <laughs>
server automatically restarting all right we might actually need the server restart get things back get the renderings back full sendex hi hello hello welcome to the citadel of nanam that is our spaceship all right uh, we're currently playing on a minecraft smp server it is a uh a private server it's called dragon riders so everybody in the server basically gets an egg and we're supposed to hatch it into a dragon and uh basically our companion right but i still have not figured out how to hatch my egg I don't know... Uh, hmm... We need to find some ice block or something. They won't have any more kids after whatever they're doing. <laughs> what are they doing? Maybe we'll just find some friends. Uh, we'll make friends and uh, try to hatch our eggs together. We'll tell them our findings, right? So we tried to escape the island. We tried to leave the island. But um, the ocean will basically render in after a certain point. Um, we protected the dragons. Did they hatch their eggs already? Nani? I'm so obsessed with these coals because like on a previous server that I played in uh, that the previous world that we played in right I was always needing these charcoals so always burning stuff there's a lot of charcoals though got like two full stacks or maybe more I don't need any more charcoals There's a person in the minimap. Let's go ask them if they figured out like anything about their eggs. <laughs> do, 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 do. Anyone hatch theirs yet? Uh, maybe they're... I think we're all trying to get settled in first. Oh. I was actually trying to leave. <laughs> I was trying to, to leave the island, not settle in. <laughs> Die! Give me your food and your wool so I can make a bed. Oi, oi, oi. Oi, oi, oi. Oh. Oh. We're starving. We need food. Uh, bu -bu 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 where's my fish? Fish! Okay. Somebody making a house. Um. We need food. Die. <laughs> There's so many cliffs on this island. So many cliffs. Jade cliffs, what it's called. Need some wood as well? Get some wood. Oh, panda! 
He has a name. He's so... so oh! There's a server restart, I think. Alright. I'll be right back while the server restarts, okay? I'm going to... Pick some flowers. <laughs> Go pick flowers. Hmm. <laughs> How long it takes for the servers to restart. Give it like five minutes. I'll be keeping an eye out on the Minecraft. But until then, we wait. You know, I think if we can't leave through the ocean, maybe we'll just try digging down real deep and see if there's like, um, maybe we can just like look for diamonds and stuff for now, you know? It's figuring out what the, the server has. I'm so used to like uh, RP lingo is in GTA. You know, you're not supposed to say things that kind of bring people out of the immersion. So if you if you say things like, oh, my server, the server is so good, or the server is crashing, like, you know, you don't say that kind of stuff. You, you call the server the city, and if it crashes, you say something like, oh, there was a tsunami, or there's like a like a storm, or some something happens, I don't know. Can I connect now? So used to it, the lingo, man. Am I supposed to use RP lingo or not? Not the. Let's see what they're saying on Discord. The immersion? Yeah. You want to maintain the immersion, it's the most important part, right? Okay, so uh, Emo Ace did post uh, information about the, the dragons, I think, or how to hatch them. Maybe? Quite extensive, though. Dragon egg. Let me just take a look. Dragon eggs. Wait. Dragon eggs will hatch into baby eggs. <laughs> Excuse me. Dragons that are tamed as soon as they hatch, as long as the player is near the egg, it cannot be ridden. You can't put it in on your shoulder, but you can put it on your shoulder. Okay, so the dragon, when they hatch, you can equip them on your shoulder, I guess. Um, but since they're saying you can't ride it yet, but cannot be ridden, eventually you should be able to ride them, right? So it's, instead of having elytras, we have dragons to ride. The player can level up a dragon using the dragon meal or being near it as it passively levels up. Once the dragon reaches stage 3, can be checked by interacting with the dragon while sneaking. Hatching. 
Um, dragon eggs will hatch into stage one dragon with the same color. Fire dragon eggs, ice dragon eggs, and lightning dragon eggs have different conditions for hatching. Fire dragon eggs, red, gray, emerald, and bronze. Oh, so we know our our uh, dragon already. It's a it's a fire dragon. Okay. <laughs> Must be placed within a fire to start the hatching process once the egg starts moving. Um, within a fire to start the hatching process. So the fireplace probably would have worked. Ice dragon eggs, blue. So we just keep it in the fire because we left our we left our egg in the fireplace for quite a bit, and uh, it didn't hatch. Uh, to start the hatching process, once. The egg starts moving. Ice dragon eggs, blue, sapphire, and white and silver must be placed in water that could be surrounded by ice. If the water around the egg freezes, in some versions, just putting in water works. Okay. That way we don't have to worry about it because we have a we have a fire dragon. So let's see. Uh let's see if we can connect now. Oh, no! Not the single player world, please! Okay. Still not back yet. Say whatever you like and we'll fill in the blanks. <laughs> it's not for the chat, though, you know? The whole, like, the RP lingo is for other players in the server, you know? There's um there's a lot there's a lot of rules that you have to follow when you're doing like an actual RP like whether it's um you know uh GTA or Red Dead Redemption Red Dead Redemption even even DayZ have RP servers and um there's like a a long list of rules that you have to follow and most of them is all about keep maintaining the immersion while you know Making it enjoyable for everybody in the roleplay scenarios, right? Do do. Flip. We didn't get in yet. We're trying to make it work. I've heard that GTRP servers are better policed than actual city roads. Ah, uh, that's uh, <laughs> that's questionable. I mean, it it does depend on the server. So the 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 server that I played on is called Legacy RP, and um, it's a it's a it's more of an arcadey kind of RP than realistic. So cars they drive really fast. And they handle like like a game, like they don't handle realistically, but it's fun, you know. But like there, because it's so arcadey, like um, the police are they mess around a lot. Um, they do pull you over for speeding every now and then, but like it's rare. Like, it almost never happens. I I think over like the the month or two that I've played, um, I I got pulled over for speeding like four times because everyone speeds, you know. In, in in a server where it's like encouraged to do crime and like um the cars drive really fast, nobody drives slow. <laughs> even even the you know the straight crip like um civilian RPers who don't do any crime at all, they still speed as well. Like speeding is just not a crime at that point, you know? Let's go! Maybe they announced, maybe they're like main, doing some fixes? The server coming back on? Uh, he said he was gonna do fixing stuff or something. Oh, so there might be some, yeah, I'm backing up the server and upgrading it. Take a break, stretch, order some food. We'll be back in 20 or 30 minutes. Okay. Um, then in the meantime, while the server is down, should we try, uh... Let's try, let's, okay, let's bring back... What we were playing yesterday, um, infection free zone, because I feel like that game we didn't quite, uh, you know, we didn't quite get to showcase what's so good about that game. Because like when we started it, um, when we started the game, 
it kind of forced us into a situation where we had to create, like, we have to pick a city ourselves, and they picked everything for us, like the headquarters and everything. So we'll do that. And we'll come back to uh, Minecraft in, uh, like, 20 minutes? In 30 minutes. Let's do that. Let's do it. <laughs> Let me, uh, bup, 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 bup. Let me switch this real quick. Oh, ha, ha. This game's really cool, too. If you've never seen it. I, was, I only found out about the existence of this game yesterday. Okay, we're gonna skip this for now. Uh, let me make my icon a little smaller so you can see all the thingies. All the important thingies. Uh, we'll do a new game. So basically, in this in this game, you get to pick any city in the world on the globe, and uh, it's gonna it's gonna create like a it's gonna attempt to recreate the city with its own like city assets and stuff. So because I'm gonna try to find the place that I'm kind of familiar with, let's go here in California. This is Los Angeles. Last time, um, we didn't even get to see all this stuff, right? Last time, it just like picked the city for us, or or we picked the city and it just sent us over. But here, we get to actually, you know, look at the the whole country, the whole everything, every city, all, all the roads and everything, and we can pick one. It gets very detailed. I think it, it utilizes some Google Maps stuff. It's gotta, and that's that's the states, right? We can also check out like. Japan, South Korea, and um, the text is all in Japanese too. So I'm guessing it might be like Google Maps related. It's pretty cool. It's dang cool. All right. So we're going to go to South California, SoCal. And I'm quite familiar with... Oh, where is it? The city where I basically grew up in. Where is it? Wait, hold on. It's downy. Do, 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 do. So, do, 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 do. Here. The so last time, I think we played around... Actually, no, not here. Let's go to Irvine. <laughs> Um, will I even be able to find my the campus that I went to so long ago? The colors like this is kind of hard to tell. Okay, maybe not. <laughs> Go here. I'm gonna find like a college. That we can spawn next to, and then um, we'll go from there. Do, 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 Valencia Drive, Commonwealth. Um, uh. Minecraft has advanced. We're just taking a little break while the server is restarting. Uh, they're fixing some of the lag issues right now. So once it gets back, once it gets back up and running, we'll start again. Okay, I'm trying to find a good spot. This is like Cal State Fullerton. It's like a university here in the city. We can try around here. Let's we'll do that. Right? I, I go somewhere else? Wait, hold on. Back. No! Not all the way back like that. Come on. <laughs> a good spot. Arden Grove, Lake Forest.
trying to find like a, the university here. I forget where it was. Is it this? No? Hard to tell from the sky. <laughs> Hard to tell from the sky. Say it's around here as well, but maybe not. Maybe not. Okay. My tiny little brain is going overdrive right now, trying to figure out where everything is. <laughs> this is how you know that I don't really go out much. <laughs> you know the city's too well. But in my defense, okay? This is like my childhood kind of area, so I don't really know too well. Alright? Maybe I'm too young to remember this stuff. Okay? this I think this is the, the a high school okay that's a high school you know what let's do it let's do the high school <laughs> we have 20 minutes we're just gonna mess around for 20 minutes pink cheese green goals poo toss nani what what you just say Pink cheese, green goals, pink cheese. Uh. <laughs> anyway, welcome, Vason. V. Vason. V's son. Hello. What's up? I would, I would, I would want to respond something, but pink cheese, green goals, poo the toss. World as we know it That's not. I don't gone. understand it. The world as we, we know it is gone. What we call the mad virus appeared, appeared out of nowhere. Out of nowhere. It made people, it made turn, people extremely turn extremely violent, violent and aggressive and unrestrainable. And unrestrainable. Soon later, Soon later the infected became, infected became bloodthirsty. More like vampires, More than, like vampires than, than humans. There was chaos, there was panic, chaos and war for panic, and war Desperate for survival. Just as dangerous as the virus itself. So the zombies in this game are Even like I am legend zombies. They're pale, they don't like sunlight. Crack. And um, the during the day, they sleep the inside buildings, world. and at night, every they come region, out to attack. Every country, every city. And last time when Drastic I played, taken, um, I was in like RTS failed. mindset, where like I felt like everything had to be done fast. I was in a time crunch. But today, we'll take Once it slow. We, we know what to do. We know the objectives. We know it's good food, to follow water, the objectives slowly. Systems and carefully These the and we don't make too many squads that we can't handle you know manage resources for so long let's see waited for any signal let's see how far we any can survive in 20 minutes the situation stabilized instead <laughs> we listened as the world grew quiet our resources were becoming depleted our resources are depleted failing and just as we were losing all hope, we received a distant call. Survivors. Seek others and rebuild. This was the impulse we needed. There were others out there. We could come back to the surface. No more hiding. <laughs> From the ruins of the old world. We will build our new home. On the ruins of the old world, we will build our new home. So here it is. All right, so we have to pick a HQ to begin, a headquarters. And um, might as well just like pick something that's close to everything, maybe? Or should I just pick one of these random ones? Uh, if I... What if I pick this one? This one's not bad. It's next to all these things. Use drive, okay. 
Do that. Headquarters. Operator, this is first squad leader. We made our way out. The neighborhood looks deserted. We'll have to scavenge the nearby buildings for any useful resources. Okay. Waiting Go orders. scavenge. Roger. And we can press V to show. Okay. Find something to eat as fast as possible. Um, all the lootable stuff in the buildings, and we're good. So our task: scavenge buildings for uh food, four canned foods we need. We need. We just wait. I guess we can um speed up the time a little bit. Boop. All right. Almost done. Okay. Building clear. So they found three cans of food and one basic tool. I think basic tools we need for. Wait, I forget. We're on the move. To advance science stuff, I think. Yep, you guys. On my way. Can scavenge that. Roger. We'll put in our last food so we can complete this task. Roger. Sir, the crates are in the HQ. We have to think what to scavenge first. It will be best to check some shops or warehouses. Shops or warehouses next. Okay, so it'll tell us with these uh, question marks if they're shops or not. I believe. Wait. Okay, so that's a shop, I think. Okay, I'll point you where to go. Operator, let's do it. Chief, I will speak on behalf of the other citizens. Let us go and adapt the buildings to suitable shelters so we won't spend a single more night underground. Roger. We need we yes. need shelters. That sounds like okay. a good idea. Um and we have workers. Alright. We should probably be mining trees. Okay. Get these. Uh, max it out. All the workers. Start cutting down the trees. Operator. Uh, what else? Adapt buildings into shelters for living quarters. All right. I can't. I probably want to turn the buildings that are close by into our headquarters. Building clear. Shelters. Maybe I'll. Hmm. Maybe this wasn't a great spot after all. Maybe I should have picked that one as our warehouse. Roger. Yeah, I'm starting to regret. Starting to regret this. Right. Uh, let's turn this thingy into a shelter. We can do a little bit of this. Wait. Buddy. Come on. Can we turn this whole house into a shelter? Scavenging operations in the dark, but that will be way more dangerous than waiting until sunrise. Uh, continue Carry on. Carry on. We need those resources. Operator. Sir, it is too dangerous for unarmed civilians to work after nightfall. Everyone will return home. <laughs> okay, let's be safe. Stop working. Start winding down for some rest. All right. Waiting mm. orders. All right. Ready for action. We're you guys can go back. There. I'm gonna check Discord real quick to see if uh, the server's up. I think it's still um, getting fixed. Blup blup. Chief, there are signs of smoke. It's coming out of a building. I think there might be some people there. I recommend we go and investigate. 
There's a lot of shops around here. Let's okay. investigate. Let's investigate. But for now, we have to wait for the nightfall to go by because the zombies like to attack Can't at night time. Sure uh, create another squad. Okay, let's do this. We have a squad of two guys. Wait. Create a squad. Orders. Nice. These are gonna be our recon guys. They're gonna be the ones that go out. Wow. The rest of them. Keep the safe. Keep everybody else safe. Another one incoming! Sir, just saw a group of infected. They might not be aware of our presence yet. Get ready. Get ready to fight. Get ready to fight. Alright, so our two recon guys are gonna go out and lure the, the zombies into our headquarters so that our other four guys can shoot from inside. Are they gonna come? There are some infected around here. Actually, I don't think I have to do anything. Yeah, we'll just wait. Another one incoming! Trying to get inside. Just wait until 5 a.m. We can start heading out when it's uh, the sun's starting to rise. Okay. Roger. You guys can check out there. The smoke. Receiving. You guys going keep there. scavenging. Everyone else is busy. Is good. Is good. Earn your keep, you lazy workers. Ya bums. Got a lot of people mining trees. And uh, this thing is part of our... Uh, our objective to build a shelter. But it might take quite a while because um, it's a pretty big shelter. I believe. This night was easy. But there are sure to be some infected around here. We should build some defenses before the next nightfall. Agree. Okay, we need to build, build a, a watchtower too. Chief, we found some survivors. They've been living in terrible conditions for the last few years. We could bring them in, but will we be able to feed them? Of course we'll accept bring survivors. Of course. Once these guys get two resources, I'm gonna bring them back to the HQ. There's this place is pretty far away. Reporting. We're on the move. You guys Reporting. done? Okay. On my way. Um, I should probably. I'll get one of these guys to make the watchtower, since everyone is busy turning this house into a shelter and cutting down trees. That maybe I should have turned this thing into a, a headquarters instead. Might have been better. Is that a car? Okay. God. Okay. So we can make a watchtower. Right. Okay. Watchtower. We can make one right here, maybe. Be like this. Here. Like that. Aha. Uh -huh. Ready for action. Let's do it. Receiving. And these guys are all busy. We still have four guys who are just chilling, doing nothing. So you can tell them to uh what should they do? They turn them into another squad. Another squad of two. Operator. Or four, rather. 
Oh, we have so many guns. Receiving. Everyone has guns? Wait. Reporting. We have four guns, Waiting four guns, orders. two Receiving. guns. All right. Reporting. That's actually not bad. We're on the move. That's good. That's good to see. Um, these guys are still no scavenging. We're on the move. My brain won't be able to handle all this. I wish there was a hotkey to like select the squads. Like, squad one, two, and three. No more to find. Keep looting. Roger. Waiting orders. Receiving. No more to find. Building work done. Okay, We're building's done. Now we just need to finish uh, building the houses, and we're good. We might have to get some more wood as well. I might break this thing down, actually. No, let's destroy this. Deconstruct building. Uh, get everyone to work on that as much as possible. And we should be good. Area scavenged. Receiving. On my way. Search done. Everybody is busy, right? Reporting. Going there. We're just chilling there, doing On nothing. My way. Okay. Ready for action. Building repurposed. Nice. Nice. Waiting orders. Reporting. Receiving. There's still two guys just doing nothing right now. Work. Work. Ready for action. On my way. Reporting. Reporting. There's nothing left. There's nothing left. Then move on to the next one. On my way. Reporting. All right, it's night time. Uh, the zombie should be coming soon. No more to find. Let's do it. Reporting. They're still scavenging. Reporting. Ready for action. Port spotted. Oh. Hurry up. Roger. Waiting orders. All right. So these guys the are the outside people who deal with the aggro. Sir, it's the zombies. Nightfall. We can already see some infected coming out of On the my way. way. Okay. Get ready to defend the zone. Just defend it. Just do it. All right. Um, I think we're gonna get uh, an objective to create um, a research center, and we'll probably turn this building into a research center, maybe, um, or one of these buildings, maybe. Actually, I want this one to be a research center. Then we can destroy the other buildings and then like create a wall around here. My plan is to create a wall like this. Here. Oh. I'm going there. For the zone. I aggro these guys away. Another one incoming. We're on the move. Nice. Nice. Alright. Port spotted! Our building's under attack. As long as um our houses, our shelters are, are not under attack, here. we should be fine. Because our headquarters is pretty tanky. Cool. Wait, let me check uh, Discord real quick. Boop. 
Server's back up. Uh, Another one incoming. All right. So this was just, you know, we're just buying time so that we can do, you know, have something to do while we wait for the server to get back up. But it's back. So we're going to go. We're going to try to reconnect. Okay. Give me a second. Exit game. Um, 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 uh. All right. Give me a second. We're getting back into Minecraft soon. Okay. Um how do I bit Right, we in boys and girls. <laughs> Minecraft because of wait, actually, I need to hide the game real quick. Okay. Back. I think. <laughs> okay, we're back. Um, let's change the webcam positioning once more. Whoa. Cool. <laughs> All right, back to our mining. Should we try? Okay, we're going to try um, leaving the island again. Hopefully the... Chunks will spawn or be visible. I wonder if our boat is still there. charcoal right all right so let's get uh, the iron ores and we should be good little bit laggy but it should be fine Ugh. wait let me ask real quick if we're not allowed to leave the main island
But if we're only allowed to stay on the island, anywhere you please. Oh, okay, so we should be able to leave. There is a world border though. All right. I'm guessing the world border is still kind of big. You should be able to leave. But oh, what's this? What's this? Is that what I think it is? The sea stone stuff? Zinc? Zinc? Nani? Yo, what's up, Nazur? Hussein? Bati? What's up? How's it going? We're currently playing on a uh, Minecraft SMP server and um, today is the launch day of this server. It's a private SMP, it's whitelisted. So I'm sorry if you wanted to join, um, you're going to have to talk to the server host. All right. And I don't know if you'll just let anybody join. All right. There might be some prerequisites. Somebody died. <laughs> Someone fell and died. Oh, no. I forgot where I left my boat. It was around here somewhere. Ah! <laughs> All right. I should have enough wood for another um, boat. Do that. Gibbity boo. Kebab. Okay. I want to throw away uh, these leaves. Kelps. I don't need them. Find out if we can leave now. Because earlier, there was a problem on the server. Um, where, like, the chunks won't load in once we venture out a little bit further out from the main island but it seems to be working now because this is unexplored territories right here nice 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 and hopefully this little island here is like a big mainland it's not just a little island like where we spawn hopefully We need to find fire first, because we have a dragon egg, right? Um, ours is a, a fire dragon. We need to put it in a fireplace, maybe, and let it heat up. It's a proper Game of Thrones uh, dragon. We're going to be the mother of dragons today. And I do need to eat as well. Oh no, it's happening again. Maybe I'll just go back to the island? Oh no. Alright, we'll just explore this thing. It might be a little peninsula. There might be a bigger chunk of land up there, so we'll just check it out. I wonder if my dragon egg will hatch if it's by the lava? Should I try it? Might as well. Might as well, might as well. Ugh. Gold ocean. Alright. Egg. Lava. I think my, I think my egg died. <laughs> Wait, my egg died. <laughs> no! It was, it was never even born yet. No! <laughs> oh no, my egg. All right, let's go get another egg. <laughs> I have to tell my egg. <laughs> 
<laughs> I managed to kill the egg. I put it in magma to see if it would hatch, but it burned. <laughs> and I tried to pick it back up. <laughs> <laughs> the egg that we never even knew. I'm going back. I think there's a couple more eggs that we can get. Maybe I shouldn't have said ex <laughs> I'll just pretend I'll just pretend that it never happened. <laughs> No, it happened. We're gonna name our dragon something, but it's gonna be the second. What should the dragon's name be? He's gonna. His name is gonna be No 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 No. <clears throat> <laughs> it's day eight already on the server. Day eight. How time flies, eh? How time flies, eh? Oh! There's someone moving really fast. Look at him! He's flying! <laughs> Wait, is that the, the admin? E Hello! What color was your egg? Uh, it, was, uh, it was the gray one. Oh, the gray one? Okay. Yeah, I think, Let me... it, um, I think it burned because you know when you pick up items, like when you hit them when they're on the ground, they turn into the the pickable pick upable ones, right? Like there's two forms. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, and then it just burned off. So I'm pretty sure um, it's just the game mechanic, you know. Oh, okay, <laughs> I can give you another egg. <laughs> oh, okay. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, no problem. Um, do you, you want to land over here? Is that? I don't know if it'll. Uh, or can you grab it? Oh. I don't know. Uh, yeah, I think oh yeah, yeah. Okay. So grab it. Uh, uh. Thank you. Yeah, it's stuck down there. Yeah, no problem. Yes! <laughs> <laughs> we were all like scared. We are just like, oh, they die. We're all checking our inventory. <laughs> Alright, it's all good. <laughs> Alright, see you later. <laughs> right, I'll see you around. Hey, what was her name? <laughs> Melody, I think? Let's be an admin. Melody. Alright, back to as if nothing ever happened. <laughs> Back to our shenanigans as if nothing happened. <laughs> um, let's see. Maybe I'll just uh, swim around this island and uh, try to find the main chunk of land. I think it's just an island, unfortunately. Of like uh, creatures around here in the ocean. You see it in the mini map. The little things. There's a siren as well. Can we talk to it? <laughs> Hello? Are you guys friendly? No, he's not! We're not. <laughs> Whoa! 
The sirens aren't mermaids, right? Mermaids are the friendly ones, and sirens are the ones that leer sailors over with their beauty. They can eat them. It's a bit of a rendering issue. It's rendering pretty slowly. the next island is the nearest island the render distance isn't like too great so oh, just gonna have to hope that an island will pop up in front of us otherwise we're just gonna be swimming or sailing for the longest time but like it's not really a problem because like once our once our eggs hatch and turn into a dragon, we can- I think we can fly them around, so it shouldn't be too much of a problem. It's just the getting it hatched is the thing that we have to worry about. I guess that's the flaw, like the bad thing about having a fire dragon. They're kind of easy to hatch, but um, there's a chance that they'll die if you get them, you know, try to pick them up and their item form catches on fire. This is a bit much. We're kind of going pretty far. Going pretty far. Hello? Started south though, right? Wait. Wait, what? Oh! Um, the island, like, uh, that we explored, our home island, um, the fog, uh, came back. <laughs> we have to do exploring all over again. Alright, that sucks. That kind of sucks. Sirens. So this is the main island, and um, there's a spawn town somewhere over here, I believe. I just need to remember where we where we came from. You can hear the sirens singing. They don't sound beautiful though. <laughs> it's definitely not luring me into their their grasp. Ocean is giving me anxiety. <laughs> Sland, oh. Sland. It's just ocean for as long as the eye can see. <laughs> Please. Land. Land. <laughs> oh no. No! 
Oh, there's the world border. Right? Wait, is that the world border? Okay. Okay. They did mention that um, there's a border so that it doesn't get too big for the server. Um, I think that's the border. Yes. All right. We, don't, we still don't know exactly how big the border is. Um, let's see. Because if... Wait, what? Hmm. <laughs> See how far uh, west we could go before we met, we encounter the border? And then if we know three sides of how big the border is, like, or if we find three sides of the border, we can kind of determine how big the play area is, you know? And if uh, if the player is not that big, then we might as well just stay in the main island. Um, what is... Oh, it's a mushroom island. Oh! Okay. What? What? Hello? What? <laughs> Can I not? Wait. Right, mushrooms! Can we eat raw mushrooms? That is the question. No. Cannot. Is there food here? Maybe? Maybe? Um... I wanna throw away one of these thingies. Okay. Red mushroom. Can I eat this stuff? Forget. Ah! Yep. Red mushroom. Uh, eat. No. Okay. There might be cows here, right? The moo- the mushrooms? But if you kill the mushrooms, I don't think they drop meat. Oh, what is that? Hello there. Uh, are you a dangerous animal? Can I kill you? <laughs> Ugh. <laughs> My health is kind of low. We're gonna try it. <laughs> oh, <laughs> he's turning around to fight. Ah. <laughs> 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 Sounds gross! Ah. Whoa! Ah. Ah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, that was a bad idea. <laughs> Let's go back. But at least we spawned back in civilization. We have so much to go! Oh no! We go so far! Uh, let's see if we spawn back with our egg. No, we have to go back to the, the mushroom island to get... Uh, get our egg back. I guess we shouldn't have fought the, the rabbit. <laughs> with such low health. I want to try digging underneath the mushroom island. I'm pretty sure we'll be able to find like um... Or maybe we can create like an underground, under ocean passageway to the other island. Not that it's really necessary once the dragons can fly. <clears throat> I'm gonna hatch my dragon. I'm gonna go find my egg and focus on hatching that dragon first thing. Yeah, we're gonna have to make some, uh, get some logs. 
some logs. Oh, that's right. You know, if we make a bed and uh, we touch the bed, it becomes our spawn point, right? I can't believe I forgot about that mechanic. That's, that should have been the first thing I did when I landed on the, the mushroom island. Ay, 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 man. Ho, oh, ho, oh, for why? <laughs> I need some more logs to... Alk. Alright. Boom. Ready to reclaim our corpse. Oh. Eh. We should make a boat here. Uh. Um, that. Right. Beeline it straight towards our body. Good. If we hold shift, do we paddle faster? Maybe? I don't think you do. Hmm. Found Amogus sussies. Anom Amogus. Mm, sus. That's sus. My, my throat's been aching lately. Maybe I have a cold. <laughs> Look at the salt. All that salt I consumed the other day decreased my immune system. Uh... 2,000 meters is actually pretty far. Like my previous Minecraft server, um, the the origin was like eight thousand. Was it like ten thousand meters away from my uh, my base? 
That was, I, I ventured pretty far out where I made my base. And when I was on foot, even going like a thousand meters was long. Crazy. I think we were making like a railway system as well that was like 5,000 meters long, all the way back to the origin. <clears throat> I might get back to it too eventually. But for now, the Minecraft content will be in here. We've got a long adventure ahead of us. And this, uh, we're almost halfway there. On, I'm still dying. What's going on with these people over here? <laughs> So that's what sirens do. I didn't even hear their their calls. Yo. No, get me out of here. Ah. Uh. Hmm. All right, over halfway there. Nine hundred meters don't seem so long. It's not so bad. I wonder if the rabbit thing is still gonna be aggroed to us. Oh, we also lost all our levels too. Dang it. Hey, how did you get flint again? It was, um... I forgot how to get flint. Oh no. We were sleeping. Oh no. I can't sleep right now. <laughs> Try to get the our bed. And sleep as fast as we can. So that the server can sleep. Wait, wait. Oof. And I don't think uh, hostile mobs spawn in this island at nighttime. Which is fine. Let's go make our bed and then sleep. Wait. There's our killer as well. <laughs> um, give me. supposed to sleep right now maybe you only sleep at night oh okay cool 
uh, sorry I took a little bit long for that um I need to make a furnace I have one okay. cook some meat Eat some food uh we need flint to make a fire. I guess we can explore the, the mushroom island. And then if anything, we can just dig downwards. To try to uh, find some of that flint stuff. I remember it's like loose, the loose kind of dirt. The ones that fall from like... Uh, the ones that don't float, right? Those are the ones that drop uh, flint, I think. Yeah, meh. Have any unnecessary items? Maybe I don't need the mushrooms. Um. Pod. We cook that first. It cooks really slow, it feels like. stuff um i think i should probably make let's see shovel even iron shovel might as well then we can start digging might have to make a chest as well do i not have any more logs uh oh There's no trees on this island, right? Oh no. Oh no. Ditch the mushroom for now. We don't need these. We don't need the moss. Six. Uh, this is exactly recipe filler click with I item to set Nani? that there too <laughs> all our junk just leave it on the ground I thought I had okay it's thingy as well I don't know what it does but um <laughs> okay the meat finishes cooking i'm just gonna put the iron inside and we can we can smelt those and perhaps make iron armor oh wait <clears throat> chest bruce chest okay Okay, back. We're back. <laughs> Can I use this dragon head? Dragon skull. <laughs> okay. Dig. All right. Let's put all the stuff in here. Okay. Twelve should be enough, maybe. Maybe. All right. Let's dig.
Ah, uh, I forget. Offhand dirt. There we go. Oh no, we should make some candles. That's right. Candles. Need lots of candles. Um, look. Wait. <laughs> huh, what? <laughs> uh, brain fart moment. There, okay. Let's go. Um, 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 That pickaxe, shovel. Ah, uh, what else? Might have to make some extra pickaxes as well. Do that. Gotta make two pickaxes. Why not, right? Do that. Okay, got some extra pickaxes. We're good. Good. Keep digging down. I think eventually we'll run into stuff that turns with this stuff. Turns into flint, maybe. Here's like uh like the rocks, right? If we just dig around the rocks, we should be able to find um I forget what they're called. The flint the flint blocks. <laughs> the flint blocks. Gonna have a lot of rocks though. I guess this can be like our temporary base too. some these stuff here so mobs don't spawn okay looks good let's bring our chest back down here actually uh, I'm gonna drop some poop -poo. Be able to bring most of our stuff back down with us. that there for now um okay Test. tough yeah I think tough is no <laughs> no it's not mind doo, doo, doo. Ah. 
pressing K to open my inventory because of the whole GTA stuff. Go. Put bed here. And uh, perhaps we can add another chest. We don't have enough wood. <clears throat> um. At. Let's leave the dragon skull here just to signify that this is the entrance. Um, take this stuff. You know what? That's fine. <laughs> right. We can cook here. Should be good. good. I feel like I was I had more um irons. Smelted irons, but maybe not. Did I lose them? Stuff, make some more handles. Okay. I think we're good to go. All right. Guess we just dig now. Stones at the end of this. Pretty a lot of cobblestones. underground cave system next. That is our next task. What was that? Zinc? Silver? Oh, 
there's a thingy, an opening. Okay, that's promising. Oh, that's tight. Resources here, wherever these are. There's so many different things. We could really use a shulko box. <laughs> it's not so bad, actually. I guess we can keep going. Um, the server even has those thingies to make a uh, blint. Oi. Up so the mobs don't spawn. All right, let's continue. This stuff that we need. No, it's not. What? <laughs> what even was that? That's dirt? Wait, this is dirt? No, it's not. Gravel. Yeah, wait, gravel. There we go. That's what we're talking about. That's what we're talking about. <laughs> I thought you need a silk touch to grab gravel like this. I thought they would always um oh, you go. I thought they would always turn into flint. Okay, here we go. What is that? Is that? that? <laughs> Mushrooms down here. There's a whole bunch of um. Okay, there's a whole bunch of iron stuff. This place is pretty cool. Maybe we should bring someone down here and show them the wonders of the underground world of the mole life. You get to discover all these weird things. there are any trees down here that might be like some kind of mushroom like a glowy mushroom it looks like it glows looks like it emits light maybe we can use it as a light source 
But I'm not I'm not seeing any um mob spawning, so um maybe I don't really need the candles. Mob spawn rate is really low. Okay. Oh yeah, I think we need silk touch for this. And I do think it's mushroom. <laughs> the way it exploded. And it made that mushroom sound. Very mushroomy sound. What is this? Huh? Very Zelda like. Breaking vases for rupees. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna use the the candles to mark where I came from. Maybe that's a good idea. I already lost it. Okay. There's no way we can miss that, right? All these candles. <laughs> There's, ah! There's no way we'll miss this. down here oh no green mushroom green glow shroom they glow okay that's cool <laughs> in case we get chased by a monster. Ah. Maybe this is why there's not a lot of mobs spawning because these glow shrooms, glowy mushrooms are uh, preventing them from spawning? Maybe? <laughs> Might even find a diamond nearby here because we're starting to see uh, these uh, dark slate, deep slate rocks. Oh, that's a big mushroom. It's a big boy. Gold. Got. What else we got? Got redstone. Got redstones. We got not emeralds yet, but soon. <laughs> got gold. Damn, they make when they crack gold. It makes my ears very happy. Someone made a into fire accomplishment? Did they hatch a dragon? Not a diamond. Uh oh, okay. There's water here. Not spilling out, which is cool. Let's see if we can uh, hatch our egg with the, the flint now. We can craft a, a, a fire starting flint, I think, with steel and um, the flint, right? Think. Oh, let's try it. 
we got steel somewhere here. Okay, steel. Um, there we go. See if we can uh, catch our dragon. A good spot. My egg. Get ready to burn. Egg is dancing. So, um, when it was in the fireplace, it wasn't doing anything like this. So, it's definitely, you know, it's definitely getting there. We're hatching it. Uh, nice. Oh, our friend, he's coming. <laughs> How long does it take? It's wiggling. Again, where are you at, little baby? What should we name our dragon? What should we name the little baby? I think we're gonna name it Gnome, like Nom, N O M. He's gonna nom nom on things. Like a nunum. But a gnome instead. Nom. Nom the second. <laughs> you had a brother. That didn't make it. In this world. He wasn't quite ready. Doing this right? Someone found diamonds already. Yo. <sighs> Wonder how we get these points from. We should just start farming uh, creatures. Or maybe we need our dragon to start getting points. Dragon. Are you almost uh, hatched yet? Should I just surround it with more fire? Maybe more fire will make it hotter? <laughs> um. Oh! Did it hatch? I can't tell. I can't tell if it hatched. Didn't. No. Oh. <laughs> Come on. Mushroom ritual. <laughs> Our dragon's being bored on the mushroom island. <laughs> this is uh the sacrifice we must make to the mushroom gods. Maybe I'll come back later. Maybe I'll just um takes a while come back <laughs> but for now we can explore I don't know if that's a good idea to leave our egg there <laughs> it's fire after all and leaving fire unattended might not be the best idea Get those um irons. I think one piece fell down, but it should be fine. Right, I'm getting paranoid. I wanna go I wanna go watch my egg. Come 
I'm coming for you. Just don't die. He's gonna hatch and he's gonna be all lonely. Maybe it's like dragons are the types of animals that like hatch and then imprint onto the first thing they see. Ah. Uh, still wiggling. You know what? I'm gonna bring this stuff to the underground. What? I think, <laughs> I think my egg almost died again. Okay. Let's make a little um fireplace uh, right over here. Right over here. There, boom. <laughs> cool. I will come back for you. I'm gonna come back. And I want to read this stuff right now. Iron's guidebook. Iron Spells and Spellbooks is an RPG inspired spellcasting mod. You can fight dangerous wizards, raid structures, delve through dungeons, collect resources, and find powerful magical items. External wiki here. We don't need to see the wiki. Uh, early game. Early game progression is dominated by exploring and looting. The world is full of magic loot, especially in new magic structures that can be found dotted across the lands. But be careful, each magic structure is home to a powerful mage will not take kindly to you. Okay. Uh, scrolls will be your first taste of magic. All right. While they can be consumed to cast the spell they hold, it is better to save them until you can inscribe it into a spell book where it can be used repeatedly via an inscription table. Okay. So we need to find scrolls. Uh, inscription table. In order to properly use a spell book, you must inscribe spells into it with the inscription table by using scrolls. Scrolls can be retrieved once put into a spell book, but it will inscribe the spell. Beginner spell books can be crafted with basic materials. Okay. Uh, so we need books. I don't have any leathers for books. I think we need leather for book. I forget. Uh, flimsy journal. Copper ingots. Well, copper ingots are actually useful in this world. Because in the previous place, uh, in vanilla Minecraft, copper is kind of useless unless you want to build uh, the lightning rods. Ooh. Uh, some basic materials can even be found sparsely in vanilla structures. Uh, arcane essence can be combined with leather armor to craft wandering magician armor. An early source of additional max mana. Leather armor. Okay, so leather armor is pretty useful too. This is really handy mid game. Upon reaching nether level resources, you will unlock an entirely new dynamic to gaining power. The scroll forge. Scroll forge is used to craft scrolls by using ink, paper, and a focus. The ink determines the rarity and therefore level, and the focus determines spell school. Oh, can we wait? So, scroll forge is used to craft scrolls. Okay, so we can make scrolls. Interesting. Uh, furthermore, intermediate spellbooks can be crafted using nether resources. Hog skins and arcane essences. Where do we get arcane essences? Did they say? Um, I don't think so. Arcane stuff. You should also start to craft stronger armor using arcane cloth. In order to get high quantities of arcane essence, you'll need to focus on raiding magical structures. Okay. And there's like rune stones. In order to continue progressing, keep an eye out for rune stones and magical structures. Rune stones are used to craft even more powerful armor. Fast mages always drop a rune of their school. Cool. Late game. Late game is uh, reached by obtaining netherite and vast quantities of basic resources and powered by the arcane anvil. Okay. The arcane anvil is the most powerful crafting station used to level up your scrolls. 
Scrolls can level up? What? Wait. Upgrade armor and spell books and imbue weapons with spells. Cool. The best craftable spell books are shown here. The ruined book is found in ancient cities. Okay. Dragon skin is dropped by the Ender Dragon. Um cryomancer armor school armor is made from arcane cloth and a particular school rune following this template okay, this is all stuff that i can learn later uh scrolls basic spell books scrolls scrolls can be found in chests looted from mobs or crafted all right so because we're kind of early game we want scrolls and what Right now, we should focus on scrolls. Uh, we're gonna need some paper. Alright. And we need trees. Is the egg hatched yet? Hello? Okay. Let's just explore for now until our egg hatches. I feel safe with the egg being there right now. It should be fine. That? Oh. There must be uh, squids around here then if there's if they're dropping ink blots. Whiskey experienced kinetic energy. Does that mean they were flying? Oi. Logs. We need more wood. We're gonna run out of space soon. Uh, that's gonna be a problem. Alright. Let's just uh, create a little trail of um, candles. And we can use this thingy. find a scroll in here maybe and I could actually use this chest like in my in my uh, little base thingy what is that it's a spawner is that a mimic am I gonna die if I okay I need to touch my bed I haven't touched my bed yet that's a problem I might die here Let's not die pathetically, okay? My egg might have hatched too. Wait, what is that? Grimsite. Do, do, do. 
Egg. Gnome. Gnome. Are you hatched yet? Yet. Okay, touch bed. Um. Put the iron away. We have our foods. We should probably keep the guidebook in here. We're gonna need that later. Um, the put this mushroom. Where can I put it? Yo, yo, yo. Mushroom can just burn. We might need this stuff for um, magic later. Maybe. Or if it's ink, we might need it to make scrolls, right? Maybe? We do need some more pickaxes. Uh, we have no logs. All right, let's go uh, see if the chest is a mimic or if it's safe to use. Actually, I think I can just like build um blocks around the the spawner and just make it not spawn. Maybe, maybe. Or if I cover it with um uh, if I cover the spawner with um candles, it's funny. I remember messing around with spawners a lot in vanilla Minecraft. The zombie coming right here. Play it safe. Um, that? Is that thing? Is that? No, oh, I can't open the chest. No, do I have to destroy this thing? What even is that? Okay, we'll come back for it later, I guess. Huh. this <laughs> it doesn't seem hostile though <laughs> the tortoise I think hello Are you friendly you friendly Oh, there's another one. It's a different uh, species. It's got like red stuff on it. <laughs> okay. Uh, we need to do something about our wood situation. This is bad.
I remember correctly. Actually, there's no remembering needed because we left our boat probably right around there somewhere. Um, let's see. The map. What are those things? The black things that's just like floating around. Oh, it might be those rabbit thingies. Huh. There might be trees here in the green patches. Um, egg? Are you hatched yet? No. Ah. Uh. Tinker's Workshop. Oh. Interesting. Are people going on some grand adventures at the moment? <laughs> While we're stuck here looking for trees. Those gotta be trees, right? Yay! <laughs> uh, let's grab these as well. They look kind of gross. Just floating around like this. Nice if they uh, drop some seeds or saplings so we can replant it. Wait, I forgot where <laughs> I forgot where the entrance is. Stuff now again we can make our chest oh yeah um <laughs> okay <laughs> okay Some sticks as well. All right. I need to make a couple more uh, axes. Uh, and, all right. Maybe three. Maybe three. And the rest, we can make uh, candles. Wait. Candles. There we go. You can smelt some more of these irons. That works. Okay. Looks clean. Egg is still wobbling. Cool. You can explore some more of the cave. And I might even try breaking the, the spawner, maybe.
Maybe we, um, we can try to let whatever it is, is in the spawn respond. See if it's something we can handle. If we die, uh, we're not losing too much. We can respawn back at the bed. So it's all good. It's all good. Show me what you got. Show me what you got. doesn't spawn maybe I just break it then I feel like if I just like it's not a good idea to just break spawners like this but uh, what <laughs> okay okay Lime balls I guess is pretty cool caustic diamond axe of the butcher on hit inflict bleeding is this good is it cursed um okay what um apoth apothic affixes advances made adv advancements made cool um Modern weapons are remarkable. It's pretty cool. I just made like four. I got four achievements or something. Just from that one axe. <laughs> I feel like I earned it. Whatever it was. I thought maybe like we're supposed to fight a boss. But oh wait. What is that? What is that? I want to kill it. Let's try out our new axe. Oh, but maybe I need armor. You know what? Ah, oh, I don't know. Hello. Oh. Okay. <laughs> <I'm> out. <laughs> Blooding is an interesting trait. Blooding or brooding? Let me see. Bleeding. Sorry. <laughs> I'm guessing it's like a like damage over time if you hit someone with it. Pardon me, bleed. Yeah, I, I, I get you. It's my fault, you know. I can't pick up on that. <laughs> I mean, or or it takes me too long to pick up on it. You know. It's all good. It's all good. Chance of an effect. Let's take a closer look at this uh, our our loot today. Uh, inflict bleeding for five seconds. Uh, it stacks, which is cool, I guess. Stacks have a thirty-five percent chance to also hit up to three nearby enemies. Okay, you can almost cleave. Thirty-five percent chance to cleave. There's a socket. There's a one socket. This item ignores eleven percent of durability damage. Uh, fortune three. Two-handed. I don't think everything else is just like standard stuff. There's a socket though. We can we can add something to it. It's cool. But yeah, I like how um the loot is actually uh you know it's pretty interesting. It's like MMO loot, MMORPG loot. It actually felt like I cleared a dungeon right now. And our egg is still wiggling, okay? Right. Put some more uh, iron in here. Uh, flawless tyrannical gem. Unique bits in bows, chest blades, crossbows, heavy weapons, leggings, shields, swords, and tridents. 20% plus 20% current HP damage. Uh, light weapons plus 3 attack to uh, knockback. Attack knockback. Alright. Core armor, shields, range weapons. Ooh. It's bleeding as well for two seconds though or eight seconds. What is that other thing? 
Oh, when it stacks, it's two seconds, I think. Okay, that's interesting. Uh, we got some more slime balls. Gold. Should probably keep a bucket with us, right? Like a water bucket. Might be a good idea. Ashes. Okay. Place this one over here. I think I'm going to save these fire resistant potions for when we go to the nether eventually. Probably best. All right. Do I use this axe as a weapon then? Or maybe it's a waste to break trees with this thing, you know? Okay. I want to make armor actually. I'm gonna make some silk, uh, steel or iron armor for now. Make a helmet. And wait. Uh. Ants. Forget how to make a shirt. Pants. Uh. Uh. Hey, give me a second. No. It's a minecart. Uh. Okay. Let me just. <laughs> This stuff. Okay. So it should be the same. Okay. Um. And gloves. How do you make gloves again? Gloves. Do I need gloves? Glove. Uh, called. No. Um, shoes. Okay. Are there gloves? Do we have gloves in Minecraft? I'm sure, we did, right? No, I guess I guess not. Never mind. For some reason I thought gloves were a thing in Minecraft. Okay. Uh, nice. Probably a crit effect or chance of an effect. Ah. We're still on that? <laughs> I think I also heard a zombie earlier, like, groaning. Maybe... You know what? There's a turtle, right? Let's try killing that turtle. Kill the turtle! Is that okay? Also probably grab some water from this water source thingy as well, right? Okay, where's the turtle? Where's the turtle? Yo! Prepare to die! what that uh, pounding does, but I'm not gonna mess around and find out. Okay. Is he dead? He got experience. Maybe it wasn't a good idea to kill it. Game got a little loud. Yeah, the effects is a bit loud, right? Maybe we should uh, do something about that. 
Uh, music and sounds. Music is off. Um, beach ambiance and environment. There's gotta be like a special effect sound, right? Hostile creatures? Maybe 50%? Maybe 60? Huh. Let's kill that other turtle first. See if it was, uh, if it made any difference. Remember there was another one. Looked a little different though. Didn't have that red stuff on its back, right? Go. It not have gone far. It's a tortoise. It barely moves. <laughs> Last seen around here. From what I remember. Oh. He's gone. Did he die? Did it die of old age or something? <laughs> okay, I guess we can continue exploring. Hopefully find some more chests, maybe. Kill that guy. Wait. Maybe we need to make ourselves like a bow? Kill it from long range and then maybe if we kill it ourselves, it'll drop something good. That's what my... My MMO gaming senses are telling me. Oi! Oi! Do that! My dragon's just like taking forever to hatch. I feel like there's another step I need to do to hatch it, maybe. Unless I just I just wait for like maybe it just takes a few hours. <laughs> There's nothing around here. We'll just dig down further and uh, maybe we'll find uh, some diamonds further down. So we're not that, you know, far down. Is that a mushroom? Mushroom? So we need to find out what we could do with silver as well. Okay. Um, okay, we're going down more. We're gonna dig further down. person okay uh, first uh, we're currently at negative 26 and if I remember correctly the furthest down you can go in Minecraft like when you hit bedrock it's like negative 52 or something like that okay so 
we can go down through here. This is gonna indicate where it begins. These uh, galleys keep dying to the spiders. <laughs> Maybe they're farming uh, silks right now. So I remember one of the one of the like a uh, I think intermediate level stuff that was described in our little guidebook said that we need um, spider uh, threads, right? Silk threads or something. I forget. We need paper as well. Discipline. Oh, someone's leveling up their skills. The magic. Okay. Right, emo ace. There's bedrock. Emo Ace is the host of this server. Um, great work. I guess we can just like uh, start digging straight until we see like a cave opening, right? Or maybe I'm too low down. Maybe I should go up a little. Hearing footsteps or am I crazy? <laughs> Just gonna keep digging until my pickaxe breaks and then we'll go back to our little uh, hole thingy to see if our egg hatched. Diamond! Diamond's pretty fast, actually. Considering we're not even at the prime, like, optimal. Wait, actually, we are. We are at the optimal uh, diamond finding level, I think. 51, 52. Something like that. If we keep going like this, we might eventually find like the the ancient cities, right? Maybe I'm not quite ready for that yet. But we might be ready to kill one of the sirens since we have a pretty decent weapon, I think. Okay. Once we find something interesting, we'll go back. Uh Check on our egg, and then um, try to fight a siren. <laughs> We're all armored up and everything too. We're good. 
We do need a, like a source of food though. We don't have any sources of food right now. The mushrooms won't cut it. I think. Unless we can like make a cook some kind of food, but I don't know how to know about any cooking mechanics. Ooh. Interesting. Oh, gross. <laughs> this mushroom, these mushrooms look so gross. There's just so many of them. It's too many. Uh. Uh. Take this. Dude. Ouch. Ow. Hot stuff. Okay. Wait, am I gonna die to this? I might I might die. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. No! <laughs> oh, okay. You survived. Nice, okay. <laughs> Maybe um, I should hold on to my uh, fire, fire resist potion later when I get back. I want to explore this area more first. My curiosity is stronger than my will to live at the moment. do should uh, we should probably try to figure out what we can do with the silvers as well eventually Whoa! all right let's mark this let us know that um there's a uh, it's dangerous <laughs> to heal with and I might be poisoned right now right what is this green stuff okay I don't want to die um maybe I should somehow kite these guys I need a heal actually okay I'm heading back I'm scared might have been a waste of spawning those guys I'm scared, okay? Uh, maybe I should have just fought if I'm gonna die anyways. But I think in Minecraft, you don't really die from poison damage. Okay. Figure out how to um, heal ourselves. We need food. Food. And there goes our plan to fight the siren as well. If I could eat the mushrooms, it would be perfect. It would be perfect if we can eat the mushrooms. I actually, maybe I'll try killing some mushrooms outside. 
I hope that uh, they might drop some meat. But from what I remember, mush mushrooms only drop the mushrooms. <laughs> only drop the mushrooms. I don't think they fight back either. A dragon, if it hatches, it would be pretty nice. We have to stay by it. It's still wiggling. All right. I'm gonna pick some flowers. <laughs> gotta use the restroom real quick. I'll be right back. to find uh, some food <laughs> store diamonds in there uh, put everything in there melt these guys okay hold on to this gem for now Maybe it's not worth using it on the diamond axe. Maybe we'll find a better thing to apply this to. Um, zinc? Wait, hold on. Do 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 do. All right, mushrooms, please. No. 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 Oh, they do drop meat. Oh, that's perfect. Wait. Beef. Cool. And we only need to hit them once because they bleed to death. That's pretty cool, too. These guys are just dying in one hit. Nice. Oh, I forget about the critical hit stuff too. Oh. Oh. Okay. Once we heal, get everything back. Let's try killing one of these rabbits as well. I think we could do it. Hen, meat, beef, beef. Uh, 
Uh, <laughs> okay. Ten beef should be enough, but uh, let's, uh, let's get a little more. Leather also be good. Give me health, please. Give me health. is so good they heal so much um i actually want to just grab like a couple more beef the meats and then go back down and see if those um the witch guy is still there i really want to kill it okay. maybe i'll grab like two more of these we should be good I have a good feeling that they despawn though, because we're pretty far away at this point. Man. Wait, what the? Okay. Um. Yeah, so I'll bring my resistant potion just in case. <laughs> Gally okay? <laughs> Gally died like three times in a row to spider. Okay, one more meat. And then let's go. Okay. Egg. Still not ready. Those tortoise thingies respawn as well. What the f okay. Hmm. Earlier, when I when I um came down here and the tortoise guys were there, and I went up and I came back, they were still here, right? So maybe, maybe those um monsters, the the zombies and the the witch is still there. Just pray that they are. And they spawned in a very special way, right? They didn't just like... They didn't just uh, spawn in. They, they were summoned by the... Summoning box to Hickey. They might be a special type of mob that doesn't despawn. Maybe? Oh, 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 oh. If I remember correctly, we were here. Oh, tortoise! Hello! It's a different type as well. I think they despawned. And... Bond. Man. What? Poor toys has there's more. <laughs> Go back. Oh, 
Ow, that hurts. I'm bleeding. Uh, they're only really dropping anything special. Uh oh. Cool. At least we're getting experience, I guess. This is not bad. Uh, where did I come from again? Um, that way. This is the way back I came from, but I don't remember those tortoises being there. Um, hmm. Damaging my oh my axe for no reason. Oh maybe I should make a diamond pickaxe next. If I use up all these um steels, steel pickaxes. Probably grab this um this water source actually, right? It probably. Hello, Octavia. What's up? Hello, hello. What's up? We're currently playing uh, the SMP server from yesterday. I don't know if you were in Chupuko's um, stream yesterday, but we're... Oh! Is it... The server restarting? What's going on? 
Let me check Discord real quick. still going maybe it just crashed for a second hmm. if anything we could just uh give it like another 10 minutes or so and maybe we can go back and jump in to some of that infection free zone how are you i'm good i'm feeling a lot better than yesterday because uh you know after that whole uh McDouble salted disgustingness incident. Minecraft SMP. Yay! It's a it's a private SMP though. It's um it's a private server, but there's quite a bit. I think I, I'm pretty sure they're all streaming it. Everyone who's playing. Um so it might be like a streamer server, but I could be wrong. I think it's like a VTuber little uh server. No more salt burger for you. No more salt, period. I think I ate enough salt for like two months. I think I ate two months worth of salt in two, within two burgers, you know? <laughs> Blood. But I'm a person who don't really eat too many like salty stuff anyway. Like, sure, I will eat fast food every now and then, right? But... Most of the time I eat, right? Like I make my own food and my foods are, you know, infamous for being kind of bland, but I like bland food. <laughs> yeah. Every time I make a Subway uh, sandwich, the, um, when I, when I finish crafting my burger, right? Adding all the vegetables and stuff. I get a strange stare when I'm, whenever they ask me if I want any sauce and I'm like, no, it's okay. They're like, what's wrong with you? I can see it in their eyes. They're judging me. Why no sauce? No sriracha? No, uh... What other sauce do people put in their... <laughs> Is it? In their Subway sandwiches. Dude, uh, for me, pickles are just good enough. It's good enough of a tang, like a twang in the flavor, you know? Hmm... I don't know if it's a good idea to not like not reconnect for me because my egg is just out there right now. But maybe it's maybe it's fine. Get mini pizza from Subway. Do they give pizza from Subway? I didn't know Subways do pizza. But then again, they do have like the 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 pita bread, right? And maybe like it's just add cheese. Add cheese to it, get the Italian, uh, the meat trio, you know, the sausage, the pepperoni, and the ham, I guess. It's it's a pizza already, you just need tomato sauce, ketchup, maybe. <laughs> it's healthy pizza, right? If it's from Subway. Seems to be a problem with this, uh, maybe it crashed, well, not sure. Sounds really good now. The pita bread with the cheese. <laughs> it's just bread and cheese. If you have spaghetti sauce, right? Like Prego. Wait, what is it called? Prego? What's it? I think it's called Prego, like legit. Get that and some cheese. You know, craft singles maybe and bread. That's already pizza. It's cheese pizza. Microwave it for like a minute or two. <laughs> All right, we're gonna we're gonna give it a like a like a couple minutes. Okay, let's try out the infection free zone for a bit. Go back to that. <clears throat> I've been enjoying this actually. Infection free zone is pretty good. You want takoyakis? Takoyaki is good. Actually, uh, yesterday I went into the the fast foods. It's called fast food. No, 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 
fast food. It's called Seafood City. It's like this Filipino grocery store franchise. Um, I went in there planning on buying octopus, like an octopus leg to make takoyakis. But um, I ended up just like browsing... Browsing the the rest the 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 store because <laughs> they had so many different kinds of fish. It was cool, colorful fish. Continue game. They had all sorts of fish, and they did have octopus as well, but um they had whole octopus only. They didn't have the leg, and I was kind of intimidated by it. I've only ever made takoyakis with that with a big. Like one big piece of octopus leg. But if I had a whole octopus, that means I'm gonna have to somehow like cut up the head and remove the beak, maybe. I don't know how to gut an octopus. And it's gross. We're missing resources. <laughs> Getting eating the head and stuff. And I wanna kill it. <laughs> I don't have it in me to kill an octopus. Yeah, I forgot where we left off. Um it's currently paused. Okay, let's let's think. We have three squads. One of them has two members in it. These guys were our um, kind of recon group. While everyone else, they do uh, scavenging and stuff, right? And this building is getting demolished. And we're gonna make a fence. I guess uh, I'm just gonna play this for like 30 minutes and then we'll head back into the Minecraft, see if it's back. If not, then we can call it for the night, you know? This sounds good. Or we can just keep playing this until we die. <laughs> Alright. Um, let's orders. tell these guys to loot. Going there. Or should I just kill these guys? Let's kill way. these guys. Waiting orders. Ready for action. All go together. Let's do it. Reporting. We're on the move. Alright. Everyone's working hard. We're good on food, good on ammo. Could use some more weapons for when we make some more uh, scavengers, I guess. Or squadrons. Oh, let me see. To all survivors, be infected with the decline. We're not alone here. There's a great IFZ. This is the infection free zone. Please respond. Um, I think this uh, is a like just a repeating little channel. I mean, they're not really sentient. They're just Chief, whatever. Same we Any weird dreams? Before, not really. But the signal is even not really. Our walkie-talkies are not powerful enough for if long I, range Yeah, I didn't, I didn't have any, like, have usually I get weird antenna. dreams when I sleep when I'm really, really tired. And if I didn't have, like, I've had, like, four hours of work. sleep or three hours of sleep for, like, two, three, three, four, five days in a row, maybe. I mean, it happens often enough, but lately I've been getting some good sleep. We're good. <laughs> have you had any weird dreams lately? Any strange dreams you want to tell me about? <laughs> Let's go there. This. Sir, we just found a car that looks the car. Let's try to make it run again. Receiving. You guys can go. Get the car. Okay. Try it. Building clear. Get the car. Hello? Ready for action. Waiting orders. Car. Let's do it. <laughs> Waiting orders. Let's do it. Reporting. Hey, okay. Let's do it. Um, what else? What else? You can't remember? Did you have a did you have like a funky dream and then you just like left it there? <laughs> Went back to bed. Cuz if you want to remember dreams, it's good to write them down. I've had like I've had days when I uh, enjoyed a dream, had a very interesting dream, but you know I forget about it. It happens all the time. Waiting orders. Going there. Reporting. Going there. Doo -doo -doo -doo. 
Okay. Our tasks. Take over the village. Take over the vehicle. Okay. Um, send squad to find technical books. Bring scientific materials to HQ. Okay. So we need that car. Where are we car. going? Okay. There's nothing left. Ah, I miss driving so much. This will help speed up our scavenging. And we can run over the infected if they get too close. Reporting. Okay, well, we're Reporting. gonna see. Roger. Ready for action. We're on the move. Receive These it. Guys can go inside. Let's do it. Ready for action. Going there. Car. Let's do it. And then Going they there. can do the scavenging work. Let's do it. Yeah. Chief, we found some seeds in one of the buildings. Okay, give me Looks a sec, like bro. There were some farming tools as well. Maybe we could use this to start cultivating hey. the land again. Let's do it. Okay, we gotta get it from there. This is supposed to be a school right here. This is like a high school, but I guess high schools don't have um scientific tools you have a couple chemistry sets maybe danger close what Winning orders oh okay I'm not in. we should have a place where we can cook meals for our citizens this will make our people much hmm. happier too okay let's build a build cookhouse. a cookhouse all right Uh, our guys are pretty injured right now. Ready for action. Let's do it. Uh, build a cookhouse. Uh, no more to find. I guess we can convert this thing into a cookhouse. That building. Uh, a cookhouse where? Cookhouse. Boom. Okay. We got a bunch of people just not doing anything right now. Um, Y'all need to work. Chief, many of our workers don't have any jobs. Send them to gather resources to yeah, construct know, or to work at some that. of the buildings. Uh, I guess, um, uh, gather wood. Uh, uh, okay, hold on. Okay, do that. We're gonna see. What? We have a the lot of supplies, so actually. To the earth tonight. Reflecting the sunlight. The sky is perfectly clear. It's almost as bright as the day. There should be no infected on the street tonight. Okay. Where's Rick Scoop? We actually made a, a new... Uh, this is a new playthrough. The previous one was a bit too... That's good. We, can use uh, a blind, we right? went in a little too blind, right? So it was like a learning kind of experience. Um, Roger. And uh, we pretty much, you know... <laughs> everybody died. They left, they died, I don't know. We were left with only, you know, a couple squad members left, right? So we're trying out fresh in a different location. We need a workspace where we can experiment and re-engineer all the pre-pandemic technology. We could store all the books there too. Let's build a research center and assign the most technical minds there. Oh, there's a lot of stuff we need to build actually. Uh, we need three fields. Oh, um, build our field over here. Okay. Here and here. That's good. Okay, let's do this. One second, please give me some time. Two, 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 two. Boom, boom, boom. We have plenty of resources right now. We have more than enough. 
Uh, this can be our uh, research center. Uh, where is that research center? There we go. Quite a few people able to work there. Uh, let's get these guys out. One, two, three, four. And max. Alright. We're min maxing our time. This is nighttime though, so um our regular civilians are still sleeping. If you're wondering about Rick's group still, they're dead. <laughs> they were all the way over here, but they died. I'm guessing somewhere. Somewhere around here, right? I think we were playing around here last time. But they're dead. Dead. Today, for these guys, we're gonna build like a a nice little wall around here. Maybe. Let me check. Let me check. Uh, Discord real quick. Back up. Minecraft's back up. All right. <laughs> Let's wait until the autosave happens, and then we'll go back to Minecraft. Rip, Rick, you'll be missed. Rip is. Uh, <laughs> it's fine. He's a protagonist. He might not even be dead. You know, he died off screen. <laughs> he died off screen, and you know how it is in TV shows and dramas. If you don't see the the body afterwards, then they're probably gonna come back. Reporting. Let's do it. Reporting. We're on the move. Receiving. Probably Going there. fine. Research center is happening. Research basic antenna technology. Okay, cookhouse and all right. There's nothing left. There's Going nothing there. left. Move to the next one, my dude. Waiting orders. Let's do it. Let's Wait. do it. Let's do it. Operator. So scavenging. All right. I wonder if I can just, like, save manually? Save game. Okay. New save. Alright, let's jump back into Minecraft. <laughs> Haven't seen Walking Dead? Oh, sorry. Spoiler. <laughs> Spoiler alert. But it's good. You know, my uh, Walking Dead, I think, you know, the first, like, five seasons were okay. And then it just got a bit too much. Maybe not even five. Maybe the first, like, four, three seasons. It just got a bit too... <laughs> too survivor-based. Like, the zombies became just, like, plot devices, you know? I don't know if I'm a big fan of that. All right, let me get back to Minecraft. Okay. Go! I want I want to hatch my dragon tonight. If that's possible. Uh, okay, let's see. Wait, it's not back yet. Hold on. Resident Evil? What do you mean? You prefer Resident Evil type zombies? Where zombies are actual threats? You've seen it? <laughs> what, like the movie? With Mia Jovovich, the old one? Are you talking about like the gameplays? Have they adapted Resident Evil like... No, I would, if they make Resident Evil 2, Resident Evil 4 with Leon Kennedy... Into like a drop, like a series. That'll be pretty cool. The movies. Wait, haven't hasn't there been like a Resident Evil series and on Netflix as well? In Raccoon City, like a pretty recent one too. Hey, hold on, what happened? Let me see Discord real quick.
Maybe. Wait. 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 One sec. <laughs> Oh, I think we're in. <laughs> coffee. The coffee's gone. All right, where were we? Uh, we got our diamonds here. Um, what was I gonna do? Was I gonna go back? Check my eggs. My dragon egg. Oh, that's right. I was gonna go back, check on the egg, and then, um, what was it? Kill some more mushrooms for meat. Fave manga is Harry Potter. Are you trying to... <laughs> Are you trolling right now or what? <laughs> Unless um, you're actually serious and there's a Harry Potter manga. A Harry Potter anime. Lost. Right. You imagine a Harry Potter anime? I can see it happening. I can see Harry Potter getting adapted into an anime. It's been it's been a long time since the movie's finished, right? Book the book story? Oh, you read you read it all? You read all the books? <laughs> They're pretty thick. That's a lot of books. To be fair though, I did read them as well. <laughs> oh. Need to sleep. fan oh who's your favorite harry potter character if you were to be sorted into a house where would you be sorted into have you you know the there's a website where you can do like a little little quiz like a survey not a survey but like a little like a little game quiz that uh decides which house you get put into wait what Where am I? Hello? No. <laughs> I think I went the wrong way. Be going here. This is where the tortoises spawn. All right. You like Snape? Snape's cool. <laughs> I think the movie makes Snape look a lot better than he actually is though. I'm, if you've read the movie, or not read the movie, if you've watched the movie. Man. Like, Snape is actually, you know, he's, <laughs> he is a scumbag. I'm not gonna lie, but he's a good kind of scumbag. I think they did it pretty well how like characters you know and and if you were to read like a story of like heroes and whatnot there's always you know they they lean too heavy on one side there's not a lot of characters that are like evil and bad but also really good at the same time you know i think those are what makes the stories pretty good and that's snape's kind of role there's my egg it's still kind of it's not ready yet it's a cyclops in this game a ravenclaw Whenever I take those quizzes for Harry Potter, I get sorted into Ravenclaw as well. Ravenclaw's pretty cool. They're the smart people, right? <laughs> also kinda snobby, I think. Oh, 
Oh yeah, that's right. I wanted to kill the uh, the rabbit thingies. Do it. Do I have everything? Uh -huh. All right. Oops. Oops. Hello. Oh. I think that might have been lag. Kill the rabbit. Anti-hero? Um... Yeah, I guess that's kind of the right, right word. Anti-hero. Like Deadpool, right? <laughs> if Deadpool is an anti-hero, would Snake, Snape be an anti-hero as well, maybe? Let's not forget where the entrance is. Uh... We get already? Am I... Oh my goodness. Okay, this guy. I'm gonna kill him. Oh. Come on. Bleed. So laggy. I don't know if it's lag or if it's supposed to be like this. Oh. Sounds so weird. Yes! He just drops a mushroom. That was uh, kind of uneventful. <laughs> what is that? It's a moosh rabbit. <laughs> Mushroom rabbit. Not really worth killing though. What is that? <laughs> it's a fly. It just dropped a maggot. It's a it's a light snack. Alright. I love maggots. I'm gonna eat it right now, actually. Actually, no. <laughs> I'm gonna hold on to it. It's gonna be my good luck charm. Uh, I completely forgot where my... My hole is. Here? Where's my little hole? Hidey hole. That's a house. Wait. Oh, 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 oh. Time to rob. Ah. What are those? What are those? <laughs> uh huh. Uh huh. Not sure if there's a point in killing these cyclops thingies. <laughs> the range on this axe is not bad. It's pretty good. <sighs> Come on, drop me something good. Other than EXP. <laughs> Oi. No. Love this place. This place is so good. No. There's so many cows, no. man. No. 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 I have a few more meats. No. 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 Oh, wow. Not bad. Oh. So 
moon maggots. <laughs> no. No. The other players on the server, they're getting such cool um accomplishments. My name is no. nobody. No. <laughs> no. Determining all the moo moos. Right. We should have enough meat. 29 meats. Nice. We should have more than enough meats to last us quite a bit now. Um, I do want to check out that one house though. Maybe murder the villager that lives there and take his stuff. <laughs> In a video game, of course. Don't forget. Ooh. Uh -huh. Oh, hello. Oh, he's a traitor. Music disc. Uh, these all suck, though. They're not that great, right? Meh. Oh wow, we can just take this. Huh? What are you gonna do about it? They're mine now! Can I take these books as well? Do I need silk touch? I might need silk touch to grab this stuff, right? Not the balsa me. Hello, I'm so sorry, okay? Huh? I'll be back to steal more stuff later. <laughs> I think there's another villager house over here too. What? Okay. Uh, somewhere there, maybe? Here? Nice house. It's a very nice mushroom house. I think it's made out of mushrooms. Books will be handy though. The books. Hello, sir. What do you got? Poo poo. As well. Ooh. Oh! Glowfish? Take that? That. What is this? Mushroom stew. Okay. Glow shroom stew. <laughs> Just stealing all their stuff. Glowing gourmet. Nice. Uh, do we have anything else to steal? Maybe not. I don't see. We do need to explore more of this island. I'll just do like a per perimeter sweep real quick. <sighs> Maggots. That. What are those? <laughs> They're uh, mushroom fish. Wow. Interesting. Mushroom fish. This uh this island has so much more like life than the the vanilla one. So if I remember correctly, the vanilla oh! oh vanilla Minecraft mushroom server or mushroom islands have only the mushrooms. Nothing more. Mushrooms and mushrooms. More rabbit guys jumping around. This island's huge, actually. Bad.
Orca as well? Orca and a whale? Wait, don't... Don't killer whales kill whales? <laughs> Is he doing it right now? He's... Nah. That killer whales are supposed to kill whales. Wait! That guy's eyes are glowing! Whoa! Oh! Let's not mess with that guy. The looting is fun. Yeah, it's one of the best uh, best forms of uh, leveling your gear. Steal it. <laughs> Steal it from the the villagers right in front of their noses. They won't do anything about it cuz they're too nice. Oh, what's that? Oh. Just the side of a cliff. Looks like Squidward. Squidward had one eye, maybe. But you know, like villagers. I don't know about the Cyclopses, but villagers do look like Squidward, and they sound like him too. <laughs> ah. They might have been modeled after Squidward. I wouldn't be surprised. Ah. Oh, there's another house. Yeah, what's this? 6,000 blocks this way. This must be a sign. <laughs> this must be a sign. 6,000 blocks? That way? Okay, we'll remember that. Uh, oh, there's, a, there's an actual village here, I think. There's a couple villagers grouped together. This might be like an actual mushroom uh, uh, island village. And the other houses that we encountered were just hermits. Look at that. Hello! Selling arrows. Ah. What a scam. <laughs> Steal their stuff. I want the egg. House is pretty cool. Look at these guys. Look at them. They're Squidwards. Ah. 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 Look at them. What? Oh. <laughs> these rabbits friendly? <laughs> Hostile. I've killed a few of their friends. Look, we needed that. Nice. Okay. Uh, some extra free beds. Just steal all the stuff. Hey, there's a baby. Hello. House has nothing. NPC feel pain too? I'll get punished one day by AI. The AI overlords will come find me and be like, you remember me? How's that one... Oh. How's that one uh, NPC that you stole from? Chipped ballast gem. Okay. Uh, heavy weapons plus for attack damage. Okay. Oh, What's this smoker. I don't have any. Oh, no. Ah. Give me my axe. Thank you. I would smoke my meats right now, but um, I don't have any uh, charcoals. You got. Chicken. All this meat. Oh. Oh. 
it. Eat these. <laughs> Steel nuggets. Obsidians. I'll leave the egg here. Um, music discs? Maybe I'll just leave them here too. I don't really need them, right? Iron gloves. Wait, they do have gloves. Um, uh, we need to come back here, maybe. Let's leave the mushrooms inside. Will burn faster than wood. Um, I don't know if it's faster, but it probably burns for longer coals. This. Is this? Wait, is this like a like a like a jump kind of uh, challenge thingy? I feel like it is. Okay. Um, I can always cheat and just. <laughs> Maybe not. Maybe there's nothing up here. Oh, kitty! Hello! What is this? Oh, you can hire! You can hire! Uh, mercenaries! That's cool. Flint knife. Ham. Uh, I'm gonna eat that bread real quick. There's so many chests. I don't know what to do. <laughs> There's too many. Eat the sapling, right? Ah. Mushroom stem, a bowl. Okay, ah. don't need any of that stuff. There's too many houses, yo. Too many. There. Ah, this is poo poo. Sticks. Rotten flesh, saddle. Oh. Ooh! Wait. When attacked, inflict blindness for, blindness for three seconds. When attacked, inflict bad luck. This item ignores seven percent of durability damage. Better than what I have right now. Plus one point seven one one point seven five armor. This is two armor. It's just better in every way. This is better in every way, too. Huh. Time to go home? Uh... Yes. We'll come back here, right? There's just so many chests. Look at all that! Oh! Eat, wait. At least grab the meat, right? Hey, there's coal here! We can cook. Ah, uh, there's just one coal though. I'm not even gonna remember like which houses I looted. I'm gonna have to do like a fresh re kind of uh, scouring of the area. Wait, 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 wait. Oi. Oh wait, look, look, my health. I have like a uh, two orange hearts. I think um it I think I have like extra extra layers of health. It's healing as well. We're we're starting to gain an extra layer. 
Uh, what is this? Plus five max, five max health. Oh, plus seven percent movement speed and lava. Also, how do I equip gloves? Lot hands. That. And on hands, plus 0.5 attack damage. Am I wearing it or am I holding it? <laughs> huh? Um. Honey? Oh, wow. Look at all these extra slots. What? Wait. Body back, necklace, head. It's like a lot of extra. Ooh, ah. ooh, okay. So there's like gems that you can wear. That's cool. Did I loot this place? I didn't. Why? All this food. Huh? Purple glow shroom. Doing it for the sake of the achievement, I guess. Huh? I have the green one already. There's a lot of green glow shrooms in the in the cave anyway, so we'll just leave that there. Maybe we'll plant some extra purple mushrooms. Maybe we'll be able to propagate them somehow. That'd be cool. Right, let's go back. Let's try to go back, I guess. We got enough. We stole enough from the villagers. And we have like a whole lot of food as well now. We're not going to go hungry anytime soon. If I can just remember where, where our home is. I should probably make a smoker as well. So those things cook meat faster than the furnace would. Right. Doo -doo. Doo -doo. What is that down there? Hello? Kind of it's cobblestone. Another villager house to the that way. But we don't have any space to steal their stuff. I guess we can check out what they have in there though. And note it. If it's something good, come and steal it. Hello. Fish. Meat. Uh, that's it. Yeah. Huh? Which way is home? This way, I'm thinking. Isn't there... Is there a way to mark home? In vanilla Minecraft? Or do we just like remember the coordinates? Maybe I should just like save the coordinates. When I find my house. All I remember is that there's a giant dragon skull next to the entrance. from this house already 
We've been here. Yes. Okay, uh, maybe the dragon head will show up on the map. Uh, is it... What is that thing? Dragon skull! Okay, we just need to go north. Okay... There it is. <laughs> home sweet home. All right. Uh, I want to make a furnace. No space. I forget the iron helmet. Uh. Can we make furnaces with deep slate? Okay, we need to make more space. Mushroom block. Okay. That plus this? No? Cobblestone? No. How do you. Okay. Furnace. No. Smoker. No? How do you make it again? I forget. Completely. Completely forgot how to make... A smoker. I thought I needed... Uh, what? Oh, Blast Furnace needs steel, right? No? <laughs> what? Uh, oh. It was the furnace plus something. Not that. Okay, let's just make another furnace then. And chops there. Yoink, yoink. Okay. Uh, we're probably gonna need another chest too. Where's my wood? Wood. Wood. Go. Ah. Uh, thingy would. There you go. <laughs> it's so messy, this place. Ah, uh, would. I have a stick. Okay. Feathers. Mushrooms, gold, wait, I have a whole gold thingy there. Ham. Good. Eat this meat stuff here and we can come back for it later. Uh, and maggots. Wait, apples are actually... We need it for other stuff. Golden apples and stuff later. I believe. Okay. 
Need a blast furnace? I might. I might need a blast furnace. Yo, soulful maple. I know you, Jason. <laughs> Long time no see. What's up? <sighs> Welcome back. Yeah, goofy little nom. Yeah, goofy little little bubba, bubba, babu. What's up? What's up? <laughs> And I'm playing a Minecraft SMP server right now, but it's a it's a private um kind of like a VTuber server, I think. Um and uh, right now we're kind of on our own, but eventually we'll we'll maybe join a faction or um if there's a is a if there's a what is it? If there's like a a monster that I can't handle. I might recruit a couple people and bring them, you know, provide a quest for some people, you know, I bring them over, have an adventure. Right now we're kind of uh, holding on to like, we're holding our own ground right now. We're doing pretty well, I think. Five silver, then three cobblestone, silver and cobblestone. It's 12.31 a.m. So I may or may not be here a long time. Oh, it's all right. It's all right. I understand. You are a growing person. You need, you need sleep, okay? Don't stay up too late. Don't stay up too late. Sleep is good. Um, I forgot what I was trying to do. We have the meat. We have some good weapons. I think I was gonna make a diamond pickaxe. Yeah, let's make a diamond pickaxe. Uh, sticks. Where are my sticks? Hey. Uh, um, let's just make one for now. All right. I think that's good. We have enough food. Some more food. Okay, we're good. Let's go exploring a little more. It's the weekend. I'm good. All right. Sounds good. Uh, sounds good. <laughs> also, you said um you got Daisy, right? I remember you mentioning that you got Daisy. On Discord before. Have you enjoyed it yet? Have you played it? Do you like it? Is the question. I mean, you need to play on modded servers. You're doing that, right? Like lightly modded servers is best. Is what I would recommend. Like day one. Day one servers. Um. I heard there's like a new ba battle royale mod, but then um, those servers are located in uh, Europe, so uh, your connection you might get like 150 ping, you know. So if you've been playing on like East Coast United States servers or West Coast servers, um, you you need to get used to the lag. What about Zomboid too? You have Zomboid as well, right? Oh, Daisy when it was on sale for $15. Oh, not bad. Not bad. Like Daisy goes on sale a lot. So it's always a good idea, you know? Keep an eye on it if it's ever on sale. Wait. Do you have GTA, by the way? I'm curious. Grand Theft Auto 5? I've been trying out, you know, while I was taking a break uh, from YouTube, I've been doing some GTA RP with 5M. Oh, it's a bat.
<laughs> and the good thing about GTA is that like their their modding community is really you know it keeps the game alive so much and that especially the RP servers are so well maintained. Um it's always a good time. Just make sure if you're gonna do GTA RP, right? Specifically, like read up on the rules. Uh, the servers usually have like a discord that you can join and uh, find out like what what you can and cannot do because role play okay is not the kind of game where you like min max and try to win all the time right you have to know when to lose and losing sounds not so great ah! what was that But there's also entertainment in defeat, you know, if you can find that funny, you know, and it's fun. You can have a good time with everybody. Okay, I think we're gonna dig downwards this way. Hmm. Yes, we'll start digging downwards. I have a game suggestion is called Rainbow Six Siege. Oh. I mean I know about I know about Rainbow Six. But isn't Rainbow Six Siege like really competitive? I haven't played a super competitive game in a long time. Like Daisy is just like, you know, it's not. It can get sweaty. But it's not a competitive game, for sure. You know what I mean? I don't know if I'm ready to play a competitive game. I used to be super sweaty when I played Dota a while back. How do I get back up again? Is it here? Favorite GTA YouTube is probably ba uh, Trayton or Pro Gamer Dude. Does he do like um? Is he a, does he do GTA Online or does he do like role play? Because I think role play and GTA Online are two like completely different kind of genres. Like they might be from the same game, but role play is like funny. You know, <laughs> I find it really funny. Online RP, okay. Do you know what server he plays on, or does he not disclose it? Is a lot of ser like a uh, if people would like to stream their content, especially like GTA. A lot of the streamers, like the big streamers at least, try not to expose what server they're playing on because um the whole you know the whole stream sniper issue. You know how it is. Redline RP. Okay. I think I've seen Redline. Is it? It's public, right? I could. Oh. Oh. Yes. So, okay. There's a lot of good um, public servers. That is what I learned. Okay. Oh, we can farm spiders here. Oh. We do need this, the strings. Do we create like a spider farming little... Uh, section here, a station where you where you farm spiders. 
What are you? Ow. He's bleeding to death. Okay. There's a lot of lag right now. The first day of the, the server launch, you know, there has been a bit of issues. But it's not bad, you know? It's... I got used... I can get used to it. What? 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 One. Don't let me play GTA because of three things the sex, strip clubs, drugs, and language. Not so much violence. Ah, that's true. That is true. But, um, if you play, you know, if you play the, the RP server, like for okay, I played the Siri uh, server called Legacy RP. That place is pretty good. Um, there are, you know, 18 plus content, but like, they don't go crazy with like, you know, the strip club stuff or, um, I mean the drugs actually, it, it's, you know, it's a part of the game, so it's quite a bit. Far from perfect. What? What do you mean? What do you mean far from perfect? Perfect. <laughs> what do you mean? Blood, blood jam. Okay. Nani? Ow. You'd fuck shit up! <laughs> It's true, it's true. I'm guessing you won't be participating in the whole like GTA, uh, what GTA? Ah, is it 6 when it's released? What is this? Once GTA 6 gets released, we'll be playing it. Because GTA, it's probably gonna be worse than GTA 5. Probably. these spiders should I kill? Eight strings? Is eight strings enough? I really want to open that, uh, that chest. <laughs> I'm gonna get something nice from it. And when GTA 6 comes, I'll be 13.5. <laughs> Oi. Oi. Oh, happy early birthday. Happy early birthday. I'm gonna keep killing these spiders until I have 12 strings. There's one more spider than maybe. Actually, let's just go.
damaging my um my axe too much. Okay. Probably gonna re regret this. Ooh. Oh no! Maybe I should have just destroyed the the chest instead of breaking the spawner. I probably would have been better to do. Ooh, enchanted book though. Obliteration. Uh it's placeable? What allows anvils to split single enchantments from books they fall upon. I think I'm gonna just hold on to this for a bit. I don't know what it exactly is for. Blessed Plague Doctor Mask of the Spellcaster. Cool. You lose this chance of getting plague from rats on contact. Plus three armor, plus one armor toughness. Must be max health. Movement speed and lava. Spell power. That's pretty cool. Okay. Take this chest as well. Noise. I regret everything. This is not okay. We explored here. Where do we go next? We keep digging downwards. Go back to our spot and start digging downwards. Okay. Here I may not pull some strings. Okay, oh god. But you know, if your parents don't want you to play GTA, it's completely understandable, you know, and respect it. Respect it. GTA. <laughs> it does go a bit over the top sometimes. Not gonna lie. Ugh. It can mess you up. Alright. Oh. Oh! Later they probably will. Yeah, yeah. In a few years. <laughs> a few more years, okay? Six will be out. Yeah, you know GTA Six. Um, it's gonna take like another year for it to come out on console, right? And then it might take like another year for it to be available on uh, what is it PC? Just how it is, right? I'm gonna take this water source. Mine now. Bah. You hear about the new COD game coming next year? It's a new zombies game. Oh, I haven't heard about it, but uh, if it's uh, if it's a zombie game, <laughs> I'm kind of I'll be interested. Is it gonna be? Isn't there like already a Call of Duty zombie game? Either a game or a mod? Call of Duty Zombies? Like literally, it's what it's called. You know what? I'm gonna do this real quick. Um. There 
go. And then we can grab that obsidian. Uh, do, 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 with this. I'm making another zombie game. It is a popular franchise or, you know, genre. We need a we need like a really good graphics zombie game. I want to I want, you know, I'm I'm waiting for Daisy 2 to come out one day. <laughs> Daisy's been out for so long and the graphics are so outdated. Oh god. We could use a change of pace, you know, with actual good graphics. <laughs> what is that? of my heart. Huh? Okay. These guys are holding on to like diamonds and stuff, right? What's he holding on to? Is that a creeper head? Ah. <laughs> oh, diamond. Hello. Wait. Oh, my inventory's full. What is that? Art of diamond. Uh, what can I throw away? Black seeds, ash. Uh, la, 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 la. I guess I can throw away the stone sword. It's just the stone sword, right? Whoa. Okay. Is that just one diamond? That's it? If you ever need help with something in Minecraft, we may need to get into a call and be the ah, best as physically possible. Maybe. Wait, there's a diamond right there. Oi, oi. Builder, all right. You're diligent if you can follow instructions. Oh, dang it! Oh, wow. Okay, there's some more. Dang it! <laughs> they just keep blowing up. Wow. Eight. Eight. Is that a boss? Ouch, that, that one hurts. Okay. I'm not doubting your building abilities, okay? Ah. Ooh. Just saying. <laughs> Sosa, what's his name? Okay, nice. All right, let's throw away these bones. Uh, we need this lodestone. We don't need that. Ooh, what is that? It's a lot of stats. Tough. It's not needed. What is that? Um. Bat's head? Okay. Um. Bat wing. Disgusting snack. Alright. Think. Take 
that. Ooh, we do need scrolls for our magic eventually. Um, bitch. Silver? I feel like there's a lot of silvers out there. It's not that valuable. Cobble Deep Slate, maybe. Uh, enchanted Golden Apple. this uh, so much rope what do you do with the rope yeah, we're gonna come back here um look if I can remember how to get back up that is Definitely not gonna remember my way out. Okay. Am I not picking? Okay. Let's go. I think it's like 4,000. Yeah. I mean... Oh, wow. What is that? Tortoise. Mr. Tortoise. Hello. It's been pretty laggy. It's been pretty laggy today. But this server is... Uh, it's kind of new. There are some issues that uh, is being dealt with at the moment. Might be fixed by tomorrow. Well, wait. This one? This way? Uh, oh! It's not here either. What? We're gonna die down here. Gonna die down here. We're gonna get lost and die. Um, let's try this way. What is that? What are those? What are those? They're just really tall, disgusting mushrooms. Okay. <laughs> okay. They're disgusting. 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 <laughs> Gross. Why have you been gone so long? Well, you know, it's just taking a break. Basically, I am, um, you know, I, I'm a kind of person who needs to recharge uh, socially, you know. And I was kind of, you know, I was, um, I was playing so much Minecraft before. I mean, I'm playing right now, but you know, I was, I think I played just too much Minecraft and burnt myself out of it. And it was, it was fun while it lasted, you know. I love playing, you know. If I were to stream, right, I want to stream a game that I'm enjoying. And I, I like, you know, I don't mind, like, streaming a lot, you know? Like, I don't mind doing, like, super long endurance kind of streams as long as I'm enjoying the game. So, like, when I was playing, like, Minecraft, like, crazy, like, before, I was actually enjoying myself, you know? And that was, that's, that's good. It's good. <laughs> But then as oh what is that? What is this? 
But you know, when we're playing on a server like this, like by ourselves, it, it gets old. That's pretty much what happened. It got old. <laughs> Where am I? Oh. I'm back, you know, I'm recharged, I'm ready to go again. I think this might be the way. At the same time, it feels completely new and foreign to me right now. <laughs> I'm gonna run out of candles. I'm gonna run out of candles. Oh no. I don't think we'll ever come back here again. I don't we're, we're lost. <laughs> lost forever. Forever. I don't remember these bases. <laughs> we're gonna have to just dig upwards at this point. Gone for half a year? Yeah. <laughs> you know, I was actually, you know, I was gonna come back. I was gonna start streaming again um, around New Year's, you know, January. But then, um, you know, like, I was watching G a lot of, like, uh, the, the, the big streamers playing GTA. Um, and I wanted to do it too, because it looked fun. But GTA, you know, if you're not in a private server, if you're in a public server, I was afraid that it would get too toxic, you know? So I was just trying it out, um, off stream, and, uh, as expected, um, on the first day that I, uh, uh tried out this public RP server, um, some, some, uh, unsavory bunch of group uh, people approached me and they started saying the n-word you know and i wasn't even streaming and they don't even know that i'm a streamer you know they're just being toxic and i was just glad i didn't stream you know and then i was like i'll give it some more chances i'll try it again and then um lo and behold it never happened again <laughs> it never happened again it was just that one unlucky coincidence or you know it was just unlucky that i happened to be in the wrong place at the wrong time and those guys probably got banned like almost immediately. I haven't really seen them ever again. Oof. But yeah, I got I got a bit too immersed into the world of GTA RP. That's while I was off, you know, off stream as well, you know. It was, it was good. It was good for me because uh, it was a good way to recharge, I guess. You know? I don't know. <laughs> Friend says he's like a tiny percent African and says the N word. Oi. Oi, oi, oi. Your friend has some maturing to do. What is that? <laughs> oh, it's a witch! It's a witch spawner. Come on, bring it on, witch. I don't have any space to um I don't have any inventory space for this guy once he dies. Ooh. 
Okay, get me, you are letting go. Fuck you! Okay. Guy has a name. <laughs> Can you die? Oh, nice. What do you drop? Uh, okay. I'm gonna discard some things. I might just discard this chest. Yeah. I don't need that. I kind of want those. Uh, what's my armor here? 1.49 armor. This one has one armor, but it has some cool, uh, better falling. Curse of conductivity? What is that? Um, maybe I'll just hold on to it <laughs> for now. Uh, what can I toss? Maybe I'll discard the rat wing. Um, and also the seeds. I don't think I need the seeds. Oh, we got a ring! Wait! Uh, we should be able to wear this, I think. Wait, what? what, what? Ring? Nice! Uh, when worn as ring, slain creatures drop 25% more experience. Cool! Gunpowder, tomato seeds. Tyrannical gem, golden apple, common ink, can craft common scrolls, cool, okay, we need that. Uh, what do we ditch? Curse of binding. This thing has curse of binding. Ah, oh, that's iffy. Okay, we don't need the obsidian. Um, take this thingy, the gem. Pull up, pull up. We'll take this common. Um, I don't want the golden apple too. What do you got? Chipped slipstream thingy. Spell casting turtle shell. Cool. Uh, plus two armor. Ah, uh, okay, hold on. Maybe we can ditch this. Oh. Eat this glow shroom bowl of soup. <laughs> oh, it makes us glow. Yo, that's pretty cool. That's pretty handy. <laughs> okay. Kind of wasted that. <laughs> um. Bu -bu 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 what can we discard? What can we discard? Look at the cobblestones. Take the hat. Um, there's more rope. Another golden apple. All right, I think we're good. We'll come back for if we can ever find this place again. If not, it is what it is. I'm lost forever. I'm lost forever! Thank you forever. By the way, this is not cap. I, I could literally send you a photo, but my school went into lockdown. Some kid brought a kitchen knife to school. Oh My goodness. What's going on, man? What's going on with the world? The thing is, like... People, ah, uh, they, they will like, you know, criticize the crap out of the kid and the parents, right? But then there's also like a sad story behind that, right? Like the kid got pushed to it, got pushed to that limit where he had to bring a knife to school or something. Maybe he felt lonely or I don't know. There's always some tragedy behind like some crazy shit like that, you know? 
sucks. The world sucks sometimes. Okay, we've been here. Um, and I'm super lost. I'm just gonna climb my way up. <laughs> Here. not it was just stupid was he just being was he just being an idiot <laughs> maybe my 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 sympathy is getting wasted is that what you're saying Be stream tomorrow. Um, maybe I'll, I probably will stream tomorrow as well. But good night. You know, thanks for dropping by. It's nice seeing you again after so long. It's been a while. Ah, uh, uh, tomorrow when you get back, maybe I won't be so lost. <laughs> My dude, <laughs> like right beneath, right beneath uh, my camp entrance, I believe. Uh, what is this? I can't even read what this says. It's small text for ants. Oh, wait, this is showing the map of the underground part that I'm in, I think. Right? Maybe not. not. This place might seem... It looks kind of right. It's all out. All right. Peace out. Peace out. Peace uh. out. see it that tree does not seem familiar at all to me <laughs> I feel like I'm close to the exit see any of my old marking candles anywhere this is not I'm not even close to where uh, where am I dude okay oh wait amethyst stuff <laughs> oh yeah good to mark this I think maybe should I just leave it here and discover it again some other day? Come back for it. We'll find it again. Oh, I see candles! 
Oh my. We found it. Alright, so here we go up. There's an entrance next to the magma. Easy. Easy. Is still not hatched. <laughs> hmm. I'm gonna have to do some research about this egg. This egg. Um, let's put our spoils away. Cursed. This thing is cursed as well. Uh, Minecraft, yo, what's up? Zentex, what's good? Uh, we're just chilling, kind of on our own little adventure, solo leveling, and uh, we found a whole bunch of treasures. <laughs> I don't really know what to do with them yet. I know that the, we we need the scrolls, these fire breathe scrolls, to somehow learn. Uh, Wait, hold on, let me, let me take a look at the instruction manual one sec. Uh, the early game. Early game progression is dominated by exploring and looting. Blah, blah, blah. Scrolls will be your first taste of magic while they can be consumed to cast the spell they hold. It is better to save them until you can inscribe it into a spell book where it can be used repetitively. So we need to make a spell book. Uh, we do have a book. We can craft this thing right now, actually. Oh, bark slab, skyward slab. Okay, slabs. We need three slabs and two fences. Okay, let's do that. I'm gonna do it right now. Bro, are you planning in any mode or it's just uh, RL craft? What's RL craft? <laughs> now, before before I started playing on this server, this is a private SMP with a couple of YouTubers, you know. Um, let me see how many people are on right now. There's a there's about like ten people on at the moment, I think. Um, but I've never done, you know, it's my it's my first time playing uh, online. Uh. With other people and this is my first time playing a modded server as well so right now i'm just chilling you know playing solo leveling and then until later on i'm pretty sure there's gonna be content where I, we're gonna need to group up with other people you know and then we're gonna find out what happens there might be factions forming at the moment that i don't know about <laughs> 
might be a little late to the party. I'm not gonna lie. But I am getting used to like all the... The way the adventure works in this world. Um, okay, so I need... Wait. Where's the wood? Where did I leave my wood? I left my wood. Okay, it's this thing. Here? Okay. Let's make our slabs. This? Okay. Um, and the fences. I forget how fences are made. Fence. Uh, gate. No? Do you, do you know what shape I'm supposed to do for the fences? Like this? What? Vertical blighted balsa planks. What? Um. This? No? <laughs> we'll get it. We'll get it eventually, right? If we just keep messing around like this. Make good progress. We made a lot of stuff. We found a lot of stuff, rather. Lots and lots of stuff. We're kind of stuck, though. Okay, it's been a while since I played Minecraft, okay? Uh, today is the... Like, we, we, we came back... You know, it's been like five months since I played Minecraft. And I just... I'm, I, I'm very forgetful. <laughs> Apparently... Okay, we need more... Um, need more wood i'm currently i currently have this dragon egg ah <laughs> i currently have this dragon egg and it's i'm trying to hatch it but um i think problems with it at the moment um i had it uh sitting in this fire for a few hours now but it's uh yet to hatch so what what do we do? <laughs> it looks like a worm. It's just an egg. <laughs> it's an egg. But once you put fire around it, it starts wiggling. And I think it likes it. So once it hatches, we can um, kind of like let him perch on our shoulder. Uh, it won't really... I don't think it will do much. But then like as it uh, gets stronger, we'll be able to ride it eventually when it gets big enough. Apparently, at least that's what I was told. I heard if you throw diamond pickaxe in water, then pour lava on the water source, you get obsidian pickaxe. Ah, uh, <laughs> obsidian pickaxe, huh? Would an obsidian pickaxe be better than a uh, a netherite pickaxe? You're trying to troll me or what? <laughs> and also, this is a this is a pretty heavily modded server. Ooh. So. The, the rumors you might hear about like vanilla Minecraft and whatnot might not apply to this world. I'm just saying. Fun. This should be enough wood to make a fence, right? Maybe. Battery? What do you mean? What battery? Let's, uh, break this down. Works it had double the durability of netherite and also unlocks the weather dragon, right? Okay. So diamond pickaxe and water, then pour lava in the water source. 
I highly doubt it. But, I mean, if you want to see it, and diamond pickaxe to me right now is not that valuable. It's just whatever. I have a couple diamonds already. We can experiment and try. Wait, you what? You want me to pour lava on... To pour lava on the water? Or water on the lava? <laughs> Grab some lava. There's some lava down... Down here somewhere. It's Kind of feels like a waste of this lava though. I'm like 90% sure that whatever you're saying is is not true. <laughs> we can try it though. Okay. Let's go waste our diamond pickaxe. It only works in a one by one block. Okay. I'm pretty sure if, you know, obsidian pickaxes existed, it would be in like the Minecraft patch notes, okay? But here's for you, okay? Do, 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 do. Okay, so he's a one by one block. You put this thing in here. Ay, 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 ay. <laughs> like that? The an Easter egg. You know I don't believe you, right? I know you're trolling, but I'm just doing it anyways. Like, ugh. Look, just look at it. It's floating on the water. <laughs> the the magma is going to touch that thing first and it's just going to blow it off. It's gone. There you go. Wow. Great. Okay, I'm going to put this lava away now. <laughs> Are you happy? Are you happy that my pickaxe is gone? You goober. Yes, silly goober. Oy. Where should I put this magma? It takes two hours to form the pickaxe. All right. We'll come back in two hours then. <laughs> um, I want... I don't want to waste this magma. I'm going to leave it somewhere where it won't destroy everything. Actually, what am I doing? I could have just uh, dug a hole and stored it there. I'm a goober. I'm a goober. anything I need advice about this egg it's just not hatching it just won't hatch they don't like me um where my sticks at get two sticks I forgot what I was gonna do now. I had a plan. I had a plan and everything. Um. Oh, that's right. I need to make a fence. Somehow. Boat? Not 
that. Now that. That. This? This? Lighted boss vertical snap? No? 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 <laughs> what do I do? Ooh. Make a fence. Like fences and walls are very similar, but not quite. Um, should be able to find something, right? That resembles a fence. Do I need sticks? Panel? Maybe I need sticks? Yeah, I might actually need sticks. Um, uh, let's make some more. Fence. No. What? Trap door. Um. That's a ladder. <laughs> um, what am I doing? Oh, Bruce Fence. How? Oh, huh? okay. I was close. <laughs> okay. Um, according to my tome. We need slabs, two, and then a book. Okay. That. That. And a book. Description table. Oh. Okay. Okay. Um. Put our thingy here. Wait. How big is this thing? Oh, it's pretty big. Okay. What else do we need to do? In order to use a spell book, you must inscribe spells into it with inscription table by using scroll. Scrolls can be retrieved once put into a... Wait. Scrolls can be retrieved once put into a spell book. But it will inscribe the spell. Your spell books can be crafted with basic materials. Uh, flimsy journal. What is this? We need paper. I have copper. Okay. I need to get some uh, papers. Do that. I'm wondering if we can even find, uh, what are they called? Sugar canes? I think we need sugar canes to make paper. Oh! <laughs> it's worth, uh... Building a sugarcane farm right now. Maybe we just make the one journal and uh, eight these sugar canes. If anything, they would be next to like a freshwater source, right?
we'll find any sugar canes on this mushroom island though. Unfortunately. Try that little body of water. I regret not picking up the sugar canes I saw on the way here. Oh, what is that? Wait. Just run along the shore and see if uh, we'll see any sugar canes. Sugar canes. Gonna have to do a little more experimenting with the magma as well for the the egg, the dragon egg. But earlier I put the egg in the in the magma, and uh, it died. <laughs> it burned to death. Maybe if I keep the magma next to the egg, not like directly in it, and just light the fire, then maybe it's better. Dragon skull. Oh boy, I'm lost again. Oh, oh, oh boy! <laughs> here and somewhere around here, I think my base is. find it it's gone forever I never learn <laughs> when I find it I should have like oh wait this place is very familiar though with the the mushroom fish um it's this way This way. No. no. <laughs> okay, it's not. I lied. Mm. How's the egg? We're gonna check up on it, but like so far, uh, so far it hasn't, you know, budged. <laughs> it's been squirming. It's been squirming, but it hasn't hatched yet. And I, I forgot where my house is again. Oh wait, it's right here. <laughs> it is right here. There. Ah. Might also be that, um, you know, while I was exploring, you know how in Minecraft, if you're not like near, uh, like a machine, it won't, it won't work. Maybe I was too far away from the egg that it wasn't really registering <clears throat> it as being in the fire for so long, you know? But we have this, um, magic book 
table thing now. Um, we have an enchanted book. Obliteration. Allows anvils to split single enchantments from books they fall upon. I need... I need to make more space. Need more, uh, need more chests, need more storage. It's so messy, this little room. Come on, egg, hatch. I need to make some more of these torches too. I think I'm gonna have to make a boat and we'll find some uh, sugar canes. Yeah. Alright, let's go find some sugar canes. Where should we go? I wish I had a faster means of travel right now. over there. Do I just go north? See like a siren, we can try to take it out as well too. Oh that place looks like it might have um some sugar canes actually. There maybe green grass, the sand is there. Please no. <laughs> we have sheep here. Any sugar canes? Oh, it's the end of the map too. It's the okay. There's the border. It's the northern border. Okay. 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 I 
I think uh, today's goal, just the end goal, will be to make the, the journal and inscribe a spell into it. And then maybe we can call it a day. Sounds good. We did explore a little cave system beneath the mushroom island. Mushrooms. We have like a very good sustainable food source from these mushroom cows. And also by stealing a whole bunch of food from the villagers. Some more houses for, for us to rob. Real quick. Wow, it's right at the edge of the border. Huh? <laughs> Nothing good. Glowfish though. Let's take those. I am kind of curious though, how big the map truly is it's um a lot smaller than i thought it would be the edge of the border is right there the uh sea serpent let's kill it this Look like there was like a boss or something. A mini map. Oh, whatever. Yo, that's huge. <laughs> okay, I'm not gonna bother with that. I just want to find some uh, sugar canes. Oh, wait. Not that, maybe I can kill you. Oh. I feel like I'm wasting my my stakes right now. My HP is completely full. Okay. Okay, oh right, that's the village that I robbed earlier, right? <laughs> it's the village that I robbed dry earlier. We didn't we didn't loot everything though. There's, a, there's still a couple chests that are unlooted. If we can't be asked.
How big is this mushroom island? Wait. This thing might be bigger than the main island that we spawned in. Pretty massive. I won't have enough food to come back later. I'm gonna have to jog my way back. I might even die of starvation at this point, at this rate. Going east. <laughs> oh, there's the western border. All right. Um, that's the northern border, western border, southern border is probably all the way down there. So it's not, it's a pretty small map pretty small oh I saw fire go rob some of these uh <laughs> huh? lovely uh, villagers oh uh, I think I'm going to cook no nah, never mind huh? no need to cook yet Careful, uh, because the the map is so small. We're gonna have to uh, be careful not to destroy all the what's it, sugar canes. Like we should at least leave a stem behind, and then try to propagate some of them. Because if we kill all the sugar canes, it's it's done. This server really relies on paper. I think. Or if anything, like somebody can craft a whole bunch of papers and destroy all the sugar canes, they'll have control of the <laughs> the sugar cane like paper market. That'd be pretty scummy though, right? Huh? Thousand three hundred. Okay. Mm. I have to be extra careful when we're running down to that crevice, crevasse. We don't die again. <laughs> well, maybe I should have checked on the egg before I headed out. It's too late now. Mm. 
I'm being too careless right now. Can't sprint anymore. Not even halfway there. that uh, blue um, bar is 97 out of 100 right now Mushrooms. Disgusting. Oh, they're so big. distance remaining maybe Get down there. Oh. oh no. <laughs> I can't even sprint and jump. I just need to take it super slow, I guess. have to exist. Oh, okay. 
do that. We can throw the ladder down. Think smart, right? Eh. Oh no. Actually, I don't think we'll die if we were to fall down here, but I kind of don't want to risk it either. about my ring stuff okay is that it wait give me that pickaxe what are you doing um can I take it what Nani? Nande? Everything's there. Okay. Um. Continue the journey. Oh, oh, I think I almost died just now again. <laughs> you journey, continue your journey to find the sugar kings. Boy, let's not let that happen again. Did you die? I did. I fell down... <laughs> fell down the ravine. I wasn't really paying attention. This island, you know, it's like so flat. And it feels safe. And then before you know it, you're jumping into a ravine. And <laughs> you're falling to your death. What is this? What's this? Hello? <laughs> What's this?
tower for us to explore. Look at that. Can't we turn something like this into our home? Just take it. Bottle of enchanting. Oh, smithing template. Potatoes. Raw potatoes. Steel scrap. Crossbow, I guess. We could try to fight some ranged thingies. Bottle of enchanting. On to this oak log. Yeah. Boing. Is that it? It's, oh, no. It's, there's more. Uh -huh. I thought there might be like a witch or a wizard that you're going to have to fight up here. Hey! Look at that! Ow! Hey, I might just move in here. This might be our home. <laughs> Why not? Chum stew. Hold on to the bread. Let's see, wait. Map. This blue thing. I kind of want to live here. <laughs> I just step on. There's a button here somewhere. I think. Oh, I think it's just a decoration. I don't think it has a purpose. Oh, did I, did I just get raided? Hello! Chupuko, how was your adventure? <laughs> did you have fun today? I'm just, uh, I think I found my home. <laughs> I'm solo leveling and I might have just found my home today. <laughs> Look at this. It's a little, it's a little castle. I'm in, uh, what is it? It's called, it's called the Mushroom Island, right? That was, uh, you know, I think this is the, this is the main island. And I just boated and, um, found my way to the Mushroom Island. And uh, I was kind of exploring the, the cave underground, and it just it's just so much stuff, you know, it's crazy. You guys should visit here. You guys should check it out. <laughs> it's massive, yeah. I was um. Also, I, I was kind of like experimenting. Um, so this up here is the the border, the northern border, and then over here is the western border. So if we can find out what the, the southern border is, we, we can find out like how big the island is. So it's actually not that big, like the whole map. I'm guessing it might be because this is the the place where we spawn, right? Like right around here somewhere. So I'm guessing if the northern border is up here, the southern border might be down here. If we imagine that this thing, the, the island is the center. You know, so it might not be that big. I don't know. What did you guys do today? <laughs> I saw I saw um Gally was dying to a spider like a whole bunch earlier. <laughs> you guys farming a um wait wait yeah, how do I get out of here? Look at that! What is this? A smithing template. <laughs> Just grab them all. Grab them all! Okay, and this is the second uh, little magic scroll that we found so far. Onions. Bottle enchanting. Died a lot. <laughs> I saw, I saw, I saw. This is a scary place with a lot of spawners. Oh. A lot of spawners. So it's like a special, like a... Is it like an event? You guys must have gotten like a whole bunch of um, silks though, right? Onion crate. What is this? Okay. Um, is that it? <laughs> I'm really contemplating if I should just like move in here. It's pretty nice. 
think that's it though. I was, I was planning on finishing up uh, after I find some uh, sugar canes, but so far, you know, I haven't been so lucky. Have you guys seen sugar canes? <laughs> we need paper. The server crashed because he was fighting some roly polies. Really? Oh, is that why we crashed earlier? <laughs> it's just spawning too many uh, monsters, the mobs. Look at this. Wait, this is, there was a room around here somewhere. <laughs> just has everything in it it's just perfect see look it's almost as if somebody was living here you know just crafting stuff they were cooking food they have a nice little barrel storage and a little you know like a food like a dining area a veranda what do you need paper for uh yeah i'm trying to make a book because uh, i was reading this thingy right okay uh Where's our... Wait, hold on. I might have left it at my, my little temporary base. The the guidebook thing. Uh, so we spawn in with the guidebook of spells, right? And I was looking through the early early game stuff. And um, it says you need a... Let's see. You need, you need a scroll like this. And you have to craft like this um, magic bench thingy where you can combine... Uh, I think the scroll and like a book. Uh, or was it? Was it? Oh, no, no, no. You're supposed to make a journal, which can hold five spells, I think. And you can equip it into like a, into your journal spot, right? So I'm guessing one of, ah, maybe not. Yeah, I was, I was looking at a description earlier and it said that there's like a journal slot that you can equip a journal to. And I'm guessing that's how you use your magic. But I could be wrong. If Sugarcane can deliver next time. Alright. <laughs> Check it out though. Look at this. <laughs> it's a perfect castle for like a wizard to live in. You know, it's cool. <laughs> All the way at the bottom. Did you guys set up... um? Did you guys set up your base yet? So this, uh, this little castle thing. I like how it's crooked too. <laughs> Over here. If you're curious. The pretty epic tower. Yeah. It looks like, it, it reminds me of Merlin's tower for some reason. From like Kingdom Hearts been so long because <laughs> i remember like the the merlin's tower is kind of crooked as well right in an island that's southwest of the main island oh oh wait am i at a village again this island is so op there's like these villagers right these um i think this is the second uh mushroom village that i've found or maybe not like, have i been here before Actually, I might have been here already. I think I looted this place already. I've stolen all their goods. <laughs> I just found like a whole bunch of meat around here. Oh, maybe maybe not all of them, but yeah. <laughs> so you guys started building already? the food we'll never run out of food on this island because um, there's a whole bunch of mushrooms as well what origins race did you pick i'm a i'm a dwarf <laughs> i'm small i'm a small boy ever seen mushroom villages before yeah i think it's uh i think it's unique to this server with the mods oh wait is that what i <laughs> sugar canes <laughs> I forgot how many I needed. I think I need like six pieces of paper. Oh, oh what is that? What is that? <laughs> we started building a tiny bit. Ooh, ooh, ooh. 
Maybe if you need uh, a bunch of cobblestones, I can help you out with that. <laughs> I have a crap ton of cobblestones right now. Okay, so I think we need three sugar canes to make three papers, right? So it's basically one to one. Let's grab a couple more sugar canes just in case. I don't wanna I don't wanna grab like the, the stem of the sugar canes yet because um because I did notice that the you know the map might be a lot smaller than I thought it would be. So if we wipe out, you know, some resources, we might not be able to. <laughs> Sugar canes might go extinct if we're not, be you know, if we're not careful. <laughs> That's it. That's all the sugar canes there are. Oh! Did I just grab these? Maybe I'll just grab one. Okay, and then I'll propagate the other two in the future. I promise. What's going on? Wait, I don't have arrows. <laughs> have, you guys <laughs> have you guys experienced the mobs acting like this? Like they're very choppy. Sea serpent? Oh! <laughs> it's too big! I can't! I can't fight it! Not ready! I need magic! What are you doing on land? Maybe he's vulnerable because he's on land. Maybe I should actually try to fight it. What do you think? <laughs> Happiness is a server lag? Yeah, I thought so. Hopefully it's gonna get fixed tonight. Come on. <sighs> it hit it once. I have this special axe that makes uh makes you bleed if you get hit by it. <sighs> oh! oh my Alright, we'll go back, we'll grab the stuff, and we'll just... Oh my god, so far away! Alright, but this is my home right now. It's a temporary little base. It's underground. Um, We got... We got stuff, like, we got, we got a bunch of, like, interesting little gems, like, uh, that I think you... You insert into the sockets of certain equipments. Um... It's all new to me. I have this... Yeah, I have a couple weird things. Like, if you guys want to check it out and take some stuff like, you want. But I'm not using them all. They have, like, a spellcasting turtle shell helmet. Um... But... Alright, actually, I should check out the book real quick. This thingy. Um... It's an inscription table. So I have this thing set up already. Um... Let's see. Flimsy journal. Uh, it's a slot spell book, five spell slots. Uh, shift click for recipe. Uh, so I have all the stuff we need. I just needed these um, papers, right? We're gonna go back, get it, and then we're gonna try to craft this journal and see how the magic things work. And uh, did you guys did you guys hatch your dragon egg by the by any chance? Even the, even the beta sea serpents were super laggy. Oh, okay. Well, it wasn't it wasn't just the sea serpent though. Like, I think um, there's like this rabbit thing that uh, you can fight over here. Um, when they jump, they're pretty laggy as well. Wait, I'll show you on our way down. You had yours? What kind of dragon do you have? Q 
you did mine take mine's taking a long time yeah I'm, i've been i've been cooking my egg for about uh, like four hours now i think or maybe three it's been it's been a while and this guy is just not hatching you have a male ice dragon how long will it take you to hatch it this guy is just cooking for for the longest time <laughs> I don't know if I'm even doing it right. Maybe I should like add more fire to the pit. Anyways, I'm gonna go get uh, my dead body stuff back, and hopefully the dragon uh, sea serpent will eat me for the second time when I get back. It's shaking. It's going. All right. My egg's been dancing for a long time though. But then again. I left my egg down there and um, I was exploring the kind of the underground. Look at that. Cows like that. Mm. Hello. <laughs> I don't know what this guy's called. I forget. They don't, they don't really drop anything interesting when you kill them though. They just gave it EXP. Remember, but I also think you have to be near it for the ticks to count. Yeah, that's what I was wondering. Like, that's what I was guessing. Because I was kind of far down, like way mm. down where the diamonds appear in the, you know, the underground spots. I was exploring. I got lost a little bit. There's still a lot to explore down there. And um, I think I found like an amethyst uh, vein as well. You guys need amethyst? We got him. Wait, what? Nani? Sugar cane's just yet here. So are you... Uh, did you equip your dragon? Is your dragon just perched on your shoulder right now? All this. But no sugar canes anyway. Bang. Hmm. Did you leave him on the ground? Because he actually blocks my peripherals when he's on my shoulder. Oh, really? They're that... Are they big? <laughs> I can't wait until my little guy sp uh, he spawns in. <laughs> Do you have a name for it? Did you, did you name your dragon? I think I'm gonna name mine Nom the second. <laughs> the first one actually died. Kind of. I was I put him in a little like a little uh magma magma lake and uh wasn't really doing anything. I tried to pick him back up. Uh, I hit it and it turned into the item form and it just burned away. <laughs> Small, but their face and wings be in my face. Oh, okay. <laughs> Maybe they can act as like armor, head protection. If you get shot by skeletons. Maybe the your dragon can tank it for you. <laughs> <laughs> what color is your dragon? <laughs> These things are so weird. Like they make such weird noises. <laughs> <laughs> I have a gray gray egg right now, so I'm guessing it's a gray dragon. But it's a it's a fire dragon, right? I think. It's wiggling. The fire. 
thought the gray one would maybe be a lightning, but I guess not. <laughs> it's like white. Oh. Hmm. Hmm. I want to see what a dragon would look like. I want to see what it looks like. I brought some food. It's gonna take a while. <laughs> What's there? Yeah. This is my second time running all the way down here because uh, I fell into like a ravine earlier. I was just not paying attention, you know. This place is just so safe. No monsters or anything. And the, the, the grounds are relatively even, the floor, you know. Just randomly I ended up jumping into a ravine. Maybe I should have brought my bed here. Okay, once uh, <laughs> once my dragon hatches and then gets big enough for me to ride, I might start moving uh, my chest and stuff over to that mage. The abandoned mage house. Sea serpent still there. Oh no. Oh. oh no. Yeah. I think that's pretty easy to dodge though, because he's kind of like flopping around. Does he see me? Okay, move away from the body, please. Is aggro to me or not? Maybe not. Panic egg! Panic egg! <laughs> that, equip the gloves! I grab everything. Leave anything behind? Okay. The sea serpent just like, he just, he just bounced. <laughs> just pieced out. Okay. I see. All right. He actually left you alone. Yeah. <laughs> just you just wasn't feeling it, you know. <laughs> I think he was just keeping my body warm, you know, just keeping it safe. Like, oh, <laughs> I didn't mean to kill you, you know. I just touched you once and you exploded. It was an accident. Go find out um, how this whole magic stuff works. Now, have you guys tried like, like any magic stuff by any chance? Maybe you already. Maybe you've already done all this stuff. <laughs> Here I am, you know, thinking I'm. 
I'm being innovative with the with the whole magic no. stuff right now. <laughs> no, no. Little magic very locked off. Oh, so you guys have the crafting table stuff already figured out. Noise. I died earlier. <laughs> Got a lot of achievements. Yeah. Um, I think it's all when I was um under underground earlier. Like um. Oh, whoops. I found this chest, uh, where I got this axe from. And like after I picked up this axe, I got like four four achievements. Okay, we can ditch these. Okay. Um. <laughs> oh, hello. <laughs> Yo, what's up? Hello. <laughs> I was gonna die. It was good, you guy. <laughs> it's good, guy. <laughs> you scared me. <laughs> Echo, yo. <laughs> I'm afraid uh, my microphone peaked. Wait, where do you go? Hello? I almost fell again. Uh -huh. Yo, yo, yo. That's <laughs> <coughs> the lag. <laughs> Lagging really badly. <laughs> I think the you server might be lagging really badly. Yeah, what's up? You show me. All I right. like your backpack. Don't don't <laughs> panic, okay? Don't panic, and it'll be okay. <laughs> don't, don't no. Oh yeah, I, oh, cool. I don't I'm think ready. you should build up like. Oh okay. <laughs> All right, ready. <laughs> is that is that from a spell? Ow! Wait, I can I have a cure for this. No, I don't. <laughs> oh yes, I do. Is that from You're a good, spell? Right? Like a yeah, I'm good. Is that is that a scroll or did you guys make a like a like the journal as well already? Yeah, yeah, yeah. we made the. Uh... Oh, thank you, sir. The steel trim too. I'm actually on my way right now um, to my home, I think. Wait, this way. Let's try out the, the journal thingy. Okay. You want to test out your spells on me? <laughs> um, yeah, we can we can try it. I have like two spells waiting. Um, I have like a poison huh? one and, and what do I have right now? What else? Okay, this is the poison one. I forget. I forget what uh. the other one was called. We'll check it out. <clears throat> And I also have some uh, equipments that a few, if you're interested, you can take if you want. I don't think I'll be using it. It's fine. <laughs> I kind of just want to see what spells you have. I'm nosy. I only have, I only have two. I only have two <laughs> as well. <laughs> so, are you still looking for your, uh, your egg to hatch? Um, wait, wait, wait. Oh, I'm yeah. to remember where it's, my... It's, it's I off in the corner right now, sting for to hatch. Hmm. Uh, I think Chubu, I think Chu said that, um, you might have to be next to it for the, the ticks to count. 
Yeah, I think that's the that's the only reason why we figured that out because hers hatched a lot faster than mine, and I was like off exploring, so <laughs> it's kind of yeah. unfortunate. <coughs> Just a late bloomer, you know. Yeah, mine yeah, as well. Yeah. Well, if it's actually the case with you have to be close to it, mine might take a a couple. In real life days to hatch. <laughs> oh, it's true. Mine too. Especially since I'm, I'm always uh, I'm always out exploring, so a solo leveling kind of as well, you know? I'm not I'm never home. <laughs> <coughs> well, because I don't think uh Chu being close to my egg counts. That's I think we actually have to be close to it. Oh, okay, that's uh Yeah. So how long how long was Chu um Next to egg for you know, the whole time, like since the server opened, because uh, she was on the island the entire time that uh, Fort hatched. I think it was about, if I had to guess, like four or five Minecraft days. Okay, well, were you guys like? But that was her dumb? consistently on the island with it. <laughs> is Chu like? Is she building while you're exploring, or? Yeah, for the most part. That's fun. You guys are like tag team. <laughs> hey, let's see. All these mushrooms are pretty nice. I, we had to look for like four miles <laughs> to go look for a cow. Went on a whole nother island. I got super lucky with this place. Well, I'm, I'm surprised you decided to settle down here. It's pretty cool. I mean, they changed the mushroom biome quite a bit with the mud. I don't know why my throat is like acting up so much. Please. Okay. I think home is. I always forget. It's where the dragon skull is. Alright, I kind of forgot where my home is. We have to find a dragon skull <laughs> somewhere around here. You can okay? waypoint it in the future. I should. <laughs> I always like, I keep struggling finding my home and then I, well, once, I get, <laughs> once I get there, I just forget, you know? <laughs> have you, uh, have you played, have you done, have you hit K yet? K? What do you mean? Hit K. Uh... Oh. Uh, I've actually been ignore I haven't been like looking at it. Hold on. I don't have any mm -hmm. points though. I don't have any points to spend. Yeah, it, it it's a lot harder right now to get the points. I just I think you're, I need two pretty close, and like uh seven like a uh, yeah pretty close. Do you know which path you'd like to go to? Um, I'm thinking maybe alchemist. What about you alchemist? guys? Uh huh. Uh, we're both gonna be a cultist, I believe. Cultist? <laughs> yeah. What is that? Oh, a cult. Oh, a cultist. Okay, okay. <laughs> uh, I think the. Which one are you doing? Alchemist. I think that one's nature and evocation. I believe. Yeah, I haven't. I haven't like looked at uh what all the um. Is it the paths are actually like specializing in? I'm just like picking one and going with it. It, it doesn't really <laughs> let you open it up, unfortunately. <laughs> oh. All right, it's somewhere around here. <laughs> ah! No! Is that a restart? Wait one sec. There's a pin message. Okay. Oh, oh so close. No. Uh. <laughs> I was so close to get back home to try out the spells. 
Maybe tonight might not be the night. <laughs> everyone else is still on oh it might just be me then uh oh oh i know why um <laughs> give me one second <laughs> yeah for some reason uh i'm keep uh what is it the older ip servers showing up and all right, I'm back. But you're alive. <clears throat> okay. Um. Wait. I thought like okay. Sometimes when I look at the map, um, it shows the, it shows that the the dragon like um, the dragon skull like it it indicates that it's there. You know, it says dragon skull and like it points to it. Mm -hmm. But. Um, sometimes it doesn't show up at all. Like, maybe you have to be close to it? Yeah, it's a proximity thing. So the Dragon Skull will only pop up because it's considered like a mob entity. So. Okay. Uh. Alright, I think we have to keep going northeast. <laughs> Lost in my own home. Hmm. The good thing about this island also is that like the hostile mobs don't really do spawn. Do mobs not spawn on the mushroom biome? Yeah, I don't think I don't think they do. <laughs> <laughs> you have to deal with skeletons and all that, all the necromancers. That's kind of nice actually. I have seen like two skeletons like in the mini map, but I didn't see them in person. Okay, well, oh, they might have been underground. Oh, yeah, that's I true. Okay. Um I must be completely off. Where was it on here somewhere? Uh Village house thingy there. Uh Okay. Might be this way. <laughs> <laughs> Sooner or later. Amoongus things are pretty tanky. <clears throat> oh, that's what they were. The Amoongus. Okay. The Amoongus. <laughs> uh, wait. I feel like it's around here somewhere. Alright, keep your eyes peeled for a dragon skull, okay? <laughs> oh, is that around where it's at? Yeah, it's like, I, I, I placed the dragon skull there to mark it. Saw it. Wait. Where it was around here somewhere, like hmm. <laughs> the worst sense of direction. Patrolling, uh, also, there's um, <laughs> there are these fly thingies that drop maggots and you can eat them. Oi. Oh, 
Oh, did the galley find it? <laughs> he found it before I did. No. I'm on my way. You can see your egg? Oh? Must be close then. Wait, it's Gally inside? <laughs> e okay. Danny. Oh, wait, where's his base though? Wait, where's it's, the base though? Where's entrance? Wait, if, <laughs> if you can see the egg. Look, if you stand right here, if you stand right here, you can see the egg on the map. Oh, okay. So um, it's close. It's close, definitely. The, the, the skull should be around here somewhere. <laughs> uh... Should we just dig straight down to it? <laughs> Oh, I think I see the dragon. Wait, dragon egg. Hmm. The egg is here. Then, the skull might be a little north of it. The skull might be a little north of the egg. Probably wrong. <laughs> the egg is gone. So confused. <laughs> hmm. Thank you, sir. Let's go. I need to. Hey, did you take the did you take the skull or did it did it disappear? No, I didn't take the skull. Okay. No one else could have taken the skull. Oh, I have a I have a fire breathing skull as well. I think the level three common. Nice. Okay, so. Ah. Uh... Let me just make the, the paper real quick. Like this. And... Wait. It said it's two coppers and one string. So I think I do need to smelt some coppers real quick. I did see a uh, apotheosis boss. I think it's a blue, right? If y'all want, want to fight it afterward, I can probably help out. Apotheosis? Oh, a what? <laughs> One of the, the boss monsters. Alright, I'm down. It's down here somewhere, right? Yeah, I saw it when I was looking for your base. <clears throat> Do you know? Do you know like what it looks like? There's a lot. Nope, I just of saw it. Th I saw it through the floor. I saw it through the floor. <laughs> all right, all right. They're, they're they're like named monsters. <clears throat> I 
I haven't I haven't completely explored uh down there yet. I have I'm killed not surprised. a few. I have killed a few. They get pretty. <laughs> oh, the name monsters? Yeah, I think I killed like three named monsters. There's another one. That's how you that get all the uh, the gems and stuff. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Um, ditch that. Here, here. Um, wait. Need a ring. No, don't forget to waypoint your base. Oh, you're right. <laughs> right, so what, what what's the button for waypointing? Oh, it depends on what you, you can hit M, and you can right click on yourself, and you can make a waypoint. I don't know what your keybind is for a waypoint because mine is different. Uh set a uh, temporary create waypoint. Okay, temp home. Hey. Hey. All right. Oh, thank you, sir. Yay! <laughs> and uh, okay, how do I use this thingy now? So. Craft the flimsy journal. In order to properly use a spell book, you must inscribe spells into it with the inscription table by using scrolls. Scrolls can be retrieved once, but... Okay, so I need to put the scroll in the thing, I guess? Okay, so I have my poison scroll and... Fire scrolls. <coughs> yeah. Okay. So this thingy and I think this. Oh. We can add this thingy too. All right, all right, I got it. I have the, Yay! Uh, the poison thingy and the fire spell. Um, let's see how I use it. Yay! Which is good. If you guys go to, you decide to go with the alchemist route. You have a uh, nature spell already. Hell yeah! Because once you skill into your spell, apparently, uh, you can only use those spells to level up your new tree. That sounds perfect. So, is it possible to like um, I guess remove the spell from the spell book, or do we have to like make a new yeah. spell book? No, no. Like, if you open up, go into it right now. You can click on a spell and then remove it. I keep pressing going to the table. to open my inventory because of GTA. Okay, press V to cast. Wait, what? Uh. It's V to cast, inscribe spells, blah blah blah. Okay. Need to equip this somewhere. Wait, how do you use the spell book exactly? Oh, uh you can open up your curios. A curios? And then scroll all the way down. And then equip it there. Oh, okay. Of course, that makes, that makes sense. And then you'll have like, yeah. Oh, okay. I thought and it was then, like a, I thought you use it as like a weapon or something. Well, you can have it as a side thing, and then you can uh, you can have a sword out, and you can still use your spells. Wait, let me just put some like a, I have too much stuff on my.
Alright, let's check out the 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 blue named guy. No, I don't know if he's still there. Let's go. Hmm. He might be he might be below. I doubt I doubt he's in the top. Yeah, I saw him through the top though, so I think we can go show straight to him rather than right here. See this name? The map? Right here, right here. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, so you can literally see him. Oh, yeah, it's a little dungeon. Oh, yeah, I didn't bring any torches. You have any torches? Uh, actually, I don't think I brought any. Oh. I should have some. I should have some. Oh, in my, in my oh. what? You good? It's a rat! It's a rat! Oh, oh my bad. <laughs> I'm sorry. Wait, how do you how do you cast it again? The spell's like Oh, yep, yeah, there you go. Oh wait, go get him! Go get him! Go get him! <laughs> How do I how do I toggle to a deliverance spell? Uh, oh, oh, what? it might be V for you. For me, I set to mouse buttons. You can mess with your keybinds. I, I haven't really messed with the the magic keybinds yet, so like everything's yeah. just fresh. You want to reconfigure it now? Yeah, give me one second. So, so the one the main one you're gonna be looking at is. Cast selected spell and open spell wheel. So spell wheel is the one that opens up unless you change your spells, and then cast spell is the one that lets you cast one that you selected on. The spells, okay, this is cast select spells V. And it kind of overlaps with some other button. I don't I forget. Maybe middle button. <laughs> you can search it so you don't have to scroll through. Uh open spell wheel R. Okay. I think this is good for now. All right, let's do it. My, my leg. Ah! Uh, I think I just lagged completely and uh, missed my magic. <laughs> oh. Yeah, go ahead and burn him. <laughs> Is he dead? <laughs> no, he's pretty, he's pretty chunky. Alright, your turn. <laughs> Alright. Maybe we can combine our magics together and turn it into a powerful, oh. you know, single stuff. I'm, I'm more scared of burning you with it. <laughs> we can try though. Let's let's. I'll go around. Alright, I'll, I'll make some uh, more space. We'll use the power of friendship. Okay. Is that what this is? Of course. <laughs> Are you ready? Uh, yeah, I'm off cooldown. All right, you ready? Yes, sir. All right, let's go. I don't know if that poison's doing anything. It doesn't look like it's hurting it at all. It might be poison. Maybe he's immune to poison. Who knows? Oh, it is a rat after all, right? It is a rat, yeah. He lived in poison all his life. Okay, maybe we should just switch to fire. I'm out of mana, though. So... <laughs> oh, the blue thing's mana. I was wondering what it was. Yeah, every it's mana. Every time I die and I run towards my body, I would see this thing refill it. Okay. Once you get to your like the magic armors, you you have like 500 plus art, uh, mana, so it's pretty hard to run through at that at that point. It's pretty good because uh, apotheosis is suited for it too, and a lot of additional mana for their. Armors. It's a chunky rat though. I feel kind of bad for it. it doesn't stand the chance. Do you? <laughs> Just, you know, We're just city. staring down at it and burning it. <laughs> yeah. Just chat and then look down at it and burn him. Oh. 
Do you want to give it a fair fight? Uh, not really. <laughs> not really. <laughs> Can you see his HP? No, I wish. But uh, Ace didn't put any thing to show HP in there. Maybe it's supposed to be on purpose, I don't know. Okay, he doesn't hurt that badly. No, he really doesn't. Maybe that's why he's so tanky. Does your sword do poison damage? Oh, oh. he's dead! He's dead! <laughs> Just take his pants. Alright, let's do it. Hey! Oh, look! Here, you can have this! Wait, wait, where'd you go? Look at this! What's this? You can have that one. What's that? Oh. Not the boots. It was a ring. I get- it was a ring. Oh, oh yeah, I got it. Yeah. But do you have two rings already? No, you can have that one. I, mean, I already have a ring. I have one too. Okay. Thank you, sir. I'll keep it. <laughs> Rat Lantis content Rat is disabled. Oh, okay. Plus 25 max oh, mana. That's, oh, that's not bad. Okay. Alright, that was pretty cool. <laughs> that's pretty good. Yeah. I'm gonna, get, I'm gonna use the inscription table. I actually got a spell from that. Alright, go ahead, go ahead. What'd you get? It's a recall spell, so I can go back home. That's pretty good. Yeah. Wait. Do you want that one or you want the ring? Oh, you can you can have the Which the one spell. would you like? I think the ring is good. I like that extra mana. Which one do you like? I'll let you look at it. Let's see. You can choose. Give me the one that you don't want. I mean, it's fine. Wait. Yeah, I'll keep. I'll keep the ring. You can have the spell. <laughs> okay. I, I forgot where my skull is again. Huh? Home. Oh, my skull is gone. <laughs> All right, Duffy. I'm heading off. All right. You have a good care. one. I'm gonna. I'm probably gonna call it today too. Right. Happy. It was fun. We should play more. House. Are you guys gonna be on tomorrow? Oh, goodbye. <laughs> goodbye. Oh, did you cancel? Did you cancel it? No, it's just taking a while. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> okay, that's kind of awkward. It, it, it's, I'm, I'm, I'm like... <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, that was fun. Um, actually got to cast our spells, finally. And uh, my egg is still... squirming. Uh, but um, I don't know if I'm going to be here tomorrow. If I do stream, I might try some more... Um, Infection free zone actually. I've been enjoying that a lot. And I wanna see what the end game of that is like. Pop on between working and projects tomorrow. Alright. So I'll see you guys. Uh maybe tomorrow. If I'm if not tomorrow, probably the day after. I'm trying to stream a lot more frequently and slowly get back on the rhythm of just like, you know, grinding constantly. Haha. <laughs> And especially like games like Minecraft, you know, it's easy to grind. I love it. All right. Thank you guys for dropping by. Um, it was fun today. Thanks for the invite again. I'm going to have to uh, edit my description so I can uh, link. How is it? Uh, Emo Ace, you know, to his uh, to his channel so we can thank him better. Ha <laughs> ha. All right. 
see you guys next time. Bye bye. Can be one together, cosmos without hatred. Stars like diamonds in your eyes. The grounds can be space, 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 space. With feet marching towards a peaceful sky. All the moon may want things their way. But we make sure they see the sun. Yeah, goodbye, moon man. Oh, goodbye, moon man. Goodbye, moon man. Goodbye. Shut the fuck up about the moon men!